hold on, let me get everything ready. Hi everybody, <laughs> welcome back. You know what, Alyssa, you're so right. It is Pulp's world and we're all just living in it. <laughs> uh, happy, what's today, Wednesday? And welcome back to the Not So Berry Challenge. <laughs> uh, Simsy jump scare, okay, I always stream at this time. It is a little bit of a jump scare though, sorry. Speaking of scared, I'm so anxious right now. <laughs> you have no idea. I'm not doing well today. My, um, my, my concert anxieties have started to kick in. <laughs> it is Taylor Swift concert eve, and I'm, at this current moment, terrified. <laughs> when are you not anxious? Okay, fair enough. But this is worse than normal. I could cry. Excited and scared. It's like, you know, both, but I'm a little bit scared right now. <laughs> This time tomorrow, I'll probably be there. Ah! Anyway. Hi, everyone. Don't cry. Think of Pulp. <laughs> oh, you know what? You're so right. Actually, I feel better now. <laughs> Let me get Pulp. That'll make us all feel better. <laughs> Simsy crying? That's a shocker. Okay. Okay, what is this? Make fun of Simsy Day. Just because you're right doesn't mean you can say it, chat. <laughs> when are you not anxious? You always cry. Yeah, and? Yeah. <laughs> Let me get pulp ready. And then we can talk. Um, you know what, learning? It's a pretty good time to start watching. We're, um, sort of beginning the pink generation right now, because the kids are kids. They're gonna be teens today, I'm pretty sure. I think that we, um, held off because we wanted to have a wedding today, and we wanted to age the kids up into teens today. Um, so we've got that kind of to look forward to. Five days! We'll probably get there. And then we wanted to do a wedding, I think it was actually tomorrow in game that we wanted to do the wedding, on Saturday. Oh, except you have work tomorrow. So maybe we should do it tonight. We might have to move fast <laughs> and and do a wedding today in game, okay? <laughs> That's something we gotta worry about. Vacation tomorrow? The problem is, I don't want him to take vacation days because we're, the whole point is that we need to max his career. He's level eight and he only works three days a week. So like we could take a vacation day, but I don't want to because I want him to go to work to like get his performance up, you know? Um, so that's my main thing. Like, we got six vacation days. We could. I just would prefer if he went so that we could try and get him promoted. Because he doesn't have that many days that he actually works, you know? Morning wedding? We could always do it in the morning. Or we could do it now. Who knows? Who's getting married? This sim, Blaze, um, and his, uh, I don't even know if they're engaged. <laughs> I think they're just dating. Okay, how about this? What if we, what if we get engaged tonight and then we get married tomorrow morning? Oh yeah, we're not even engaged. Okay, we'll get engaged tonight and then married tomorrow morning and then Blaze can go to work after. <laughs> Great. <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> okay, let me get- let me get pulp ready and then we can chat. Um... Can you make a funny face, please? Oh yeah. The burnt toilet in the background I think really adds to it. Okay. <laughs> well, hi everyone. Welcome back. Uh, we have a couple things to chat about today. Number one, the stream is sponsored. Number two, um, it's pulp. That's all. That's all you need to know. <laughs> hey Beth, thanks for the 23 months. Luke, hello, thank you for the raid. Um, yeah, this is my dog. A very sim sentence, yeah. We're like, oh, he can get engaged tonight, married tomorrow, and then go to work after. <laughs> it's, you know, we're moving fast. Welcome to The Sims 4. <laughs> anyway, Beth and Kenzo and Robin and Monique and, and uh, Butter and Anonymous and Lena and Sarah, Wab, Gem, Soap, um, Aster and Lulu and Egg and Capricorn and Minnie, uh, OG and Lulu and Erin and Emily. Uh, Dandy, Salty, Basque, and Cheesy, and Erin, and Lauren, and Tuna, thank you all for the subs, everybody. I really, really appreciate that. Um, you were all very kind. Pulp Flower Pal? We should probably bring Pulp to the wedding. I don't think that we could do it without him. Oh, you know what? Maybe we should start placing some stuff before we do that. Where do we want to get married? 
I guess we should probably decide that part first. Oh yeah, we'll get pulp and a bow tie for the wedding. Or a dress. I'll have to decide. We'll look in cast too. We have a lot of prep to do. Um, Sulani? I feel like we always do weddings at Sulani. The other thing that I wanted to place, we made last week, um, actually during our other Green Chef sponsored stream, we made the Kale Cafe and it's like a restaurant. So maybe I'll place that here too so that we can go. I won't get married at the restaurant. Um, oh, hi. Look who it is. We have a guest. Hi, Snap. You gonna say hi to everybody? <laughs> Maybe and Rach and Christina and Danny and Kat and Kate and Emma and Bree and hey, thank you all for the subs. She's here to help, it seems. Get married at the restaurant, yes. I don't think there's anything good enough for us here. It's not very like wedding vibes. Did it delete one of my half walls? Why? 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 I don't care. I'm not fixing it right now. It is laggy over here. Okay, then we can go play somewhere for the wedding to happen as well. Snow in Mount Komorebi. Ooh, if we get married in the snow, our orange outfit will really stand out. Interesting. Interesting. Okay, that's an idea. Let's pick the outfits first and then we can decide where we get married. But Malcolm Rebbe would mean that the orange boss, would be very boss. bold. <laughs> the, the orange would really stick out for everybody. Ooh. Oh, you know what? That's kind of good. Should we wear this? Huh. I'm kind of into this as the wedding outfit. We probably don't even need to change it. Let me see what Iris is wearing. Because... Mm -hmm. Yeah, I want like a more, oh, we can wear this. That's fine. Okay, I'll probably put that as my first outfit though. So I automatically wear it. And what do you two have on? Mm, I want something more like, I don't know, almost like flower girl vibes. We'll wear pink. Um, this one's kind of sparkly. See, that's really cute, right? I think so. Is Raisin an elder? Yeah, Raisin is an elder. I'm trying not to think about it too much because it's hurting my feelings. So I'm just pretending it's not happening. Okay, they can be ready. What is Raisin wearing? Where's Bran? Where do you think Bran is? Dead. Dead. <laughs> Bran is, is uh, dead as of last stream, <laughs> so. Oh, Pulp! I was gonna give Pulp a, a bow tie, I forgot. I was distracted by the cat. Uh -huh, okay. Hello, Pulp. Um, are you smelly or do you just look like that? I'm not sure. Oh, wow. Um, does this come in orange? Oh my god, Pulp is ready! Okay. What is Green Chef? Oh, fancy you asking, because I'm going to tell you right now. <laughs> okay, so basically, uh, I wanted to give people a chance to come in before we started with this, but um, I'll leave Pulp here. Today's stream is in fact sponsored by Green Chef. Um, second stream sponsored by Green Chef. Very exciting. Thank you, Green Chef. Uh, but if you're not familiar, Green Chef is basically like a, one of those meal delivery kit services um, where you pick out some recipes and then they send you the ingredients so that you can make them. Um, it's super convenient and super helpful, especially if you're busy to not have to worry about like picking out meals and stuff and they give you all of the ingredients so you can cook it. They have a ton of vegan and vegetarian options, which is great for me. Um, obviously, it's hard to find that kind of thing in these sort of meal delivery services. Um, uh, but anyway, I wanted to show you guys because my box came today. In fact, this is something that I was kind of worried about because um, we had planned to do the second stream today uh, and they were like, oh, you can do it like when the box comes, they come on Wednesdays. And I was like, oh, hopefully it comes in time for the stream because <laughs> I can't do it tomorrow because I'm going to see Taylor Swift tomorrow. Um, but it is in fact here. So I thought we could unbox. My cat being on my desk right now is actually really inconvenient. Hold on. Um, I want to take my headphones off so I don't get caught in the cord. Okay. Look. Oh my god. I don't know if I can pick it up. <laughs> hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay. Oh dear god. 
I got it, I got it. Snap, do you wanna see? Yeah, you do? Okay. Oh, <gasps> it's heavy. No, no, don't leave. Oh, okay. Green Chef is not cat approved. The box is too big and it's in her way, but I like it, so that's all that matters. <laughs> anyway, I got, these are my meals. I kind of had forgotten what I picked out. I did open it already, so don't worry. There's no, I took my address off this box. But look what I got this week, ready? Baja cauliflower bowls. I'm going to make this for dinner today. Peanut udon noodle bowls. I am not making that for dinner today, but I will eat it soon. <laughs> And the last one is chimichurri white bean stuffed peppers. Don't those all sound really good? I'm really excited about this. Uh, but anyway, if you're interested in Green Chef, they send you the food like this. It comes in a little bag with all of your things together. It's not focusing. And that'll have the recipe. Um, but then you can cook it. It's so convenient, so helpful. Um, and I'm really excited about it. <laughs> so you can obviously pick your meals each week. Oh my God. Careful. Okay. You can pick your meals each week. Um, they have a lot of options and they're all, in my opinion, very delicious. So, oh yeah, these are, I did paint my nails. Well, they're getting kind of chipped. I need to paint them again, but um, I'm really excited about it. So <laughs> if you are interested, um, they are giving a huge discount code to us. You can get, as this tells you, 60% off and free shipping if you use my code. The code kind of complicated. The link automatically, when you use the link in chat, it'll automatically apply that code, which might be a little bit easier to follow. <laughs> um, the link is, uh, the link is automatically applies it instead of using code POGLILSIMZY APR60. <laughs> um, the link will automatically apply the code if you wanted to check it out. But um, that, I think the discount only works in the US. Um, but the code is going to be available for another few weeks, high heels. It's 30 days total, and the first stream was last week, so it should be like three more weeks um, that the code is available for. So if you don't need it this week, you could buy it like next week or whatever, you know. Um, but you get a pretty good discount on it. So shout out Hello, I mean, shout out <laughs> Green Chef. <laughs> I'm sorry, I saw some people in chat talking about HelloFresh. HelloFresh owns Green Chef. Um, <laughs> oops, <laughs> oops, <laughs> shout out Green Chef. Thank you for that sponsoring this stream. <laughs> Hello Green Chef, that's what I meant to say. Um, hello to Green Chef, um, my dear friend. Yeah, they have a lot of vegan options, Liz. That's one of the things that I like the best about it. These, all of these things that I picked out are vegan, and they, these aren't, these weren't even all of the vegan options they had this week. I didn't, obviously, I just got three, but, um, they have a lot of options for, like, all dietary preferences, um, and also all of their stuff is certified organic, so if that's important to you, um, that's pretty cool. I don't think that anyone else even has that, which is pretty awesome, so, um, anyway, thank you to Green Chef for sponsoring today's stream. Um, pulp is so grateful. <laughs> yeah, there's like 30 something meals per week you can pick from. If you look on the website, let me see if I can pull it up. Hold on. They sent me, um, the, when I had a call with them, they were like, use this link. Cause this just has the menus. <laughs> um, so don't like go to the order page cause you don't want to dox yourself. Here we go. This is the menu page. This is the right link that we want. Um, decline offer. I already have one, <laughs> uh, but they have a lot of stuff. Um, this is the menu for next week, but you can see they have, um, it just keeps going. It just keeps going. Look at that. Sriracha tamari tofu bowls, black bean and mushroom enchiladas. I made enchiladas last night. <laughs> uh, but they have a lot of options, a lot of vegan options too. They're not all vegan. Obviously we looked at a bunch that weren't, but, um, that is good for me. So, <laughs> Um, thank you to Green Chef. Very delicious. What's my favorite food? I don't know. That's a good question. Display capture off. Um, let's go this way. Back to the house. How'd you get the dog outfits? Um, if you have cats and dogs, there will be pets. Um, there'll be pet outfits and stuff. I, I think the, I think that the bow tie is from cats and dogs and not from, oh my God, the wedding venue. Dang it. <laughs> also, somebody just bought Green Chef. Thank you. I knew I was forgetting something. I've distracted myself. Oh no. Did you, Em? That sounds really good. Come back. Do they do any vegetarian meals on Green Chef? Yeah, they have a lot of vegetarian options, a lot of vegan options too. Um, Difference being the vegan ones don't have like dairy products and stuff in them, obviously, but they have vegetarian options too. 
Should get married at the restaurant? I don't know if I want to. <laughs> I don't know if I want to. Um, okay, let's go back to Mount Komorebi and see if we want to put something over there, yeah? I guess we talked about maybe one of these rentals could be a reasonable place to do the wedding, and then we could see about, like, um, updating it so that it works as a place that we can visit for it and it'll be snowy. I think that would be good. I think that would be good. Anyway, <laughs> birthday for Reese and, and Frito and Azura and Emma and Coco, Griffy with the 25 months, hello, uh, Garnet and Emo and Hurdy and Christine with the 60 months, Lex, Midnight, Scoth and Abby and Kat and Synthetic and Becca and Steph and Soup and Beth and Huffle and Cute Frog and Witch. Oh my goodness, thank you all so much. Okay, I don't know if I want to do it here or not. Are we going to have a wedding party or are we just going to bring ourselves out to the... What do you guys think? Because we could, if we, like, edited some of this, we could have a real wedding party here. Or we could just, like, get married. I think I want to do a real wedding. Maybe I won't do it here, because then I can get an easy wedding venue that I've already built. Because that way we have, like, people that we can have as the flower pals and stuff. Because we, we, we spent this whole time waiting on purpose for the kids to be children so they could come. Um, and so it would be silly for us to, like, not take advantage of it, you know? Um, okay, let's see. Lot, slot type, wedding venue. Um, the beach was the idea that chat had suggested. This would be an easy bet, huh? Uh, Morgan, I'll be here for like three hours probably today. That's the plan. I usually stream for three hours. Um, oh, I have a different beach place though. Never mind. I want something else. Go away. No, wait. Did I build it there? Maybe I built it there. Different Tartosa wedding venue. Beach always goes bad though. Yeah. <laughs> we could do it here. This'll be a good one. Because this this lot will be like... No one's going to be in the background very very much. They won't be just swimming behind us. <laughs> Kayla, I have a question. Where is your wedding ring? I noticed you didn't have it on in the unboxing of Green Chef. Okay, gamers, I don't really like jewelry, so I don't wear rings that much. <laughs> I don't really wear any jewelry at all. So, <laughs> uh, just to address the rumors, I don't wear much jewelry. I wear it sometimes. I don't always wear it. But I'm not, a, I'm not really a big ring person, so. Uh, believe it or not, this does not affect my relationship. <laughs> I know, shocking, right? But <laughs> uh, yeah, I don't. I just don't like jewelry that much, so I don't always have it on. Um, I'm sure there are actual, actual rumors about it. I don't know. I'm sure that people have thought about it, but I, it's just not that deep. <laughs> like, <laughs> it's just not that deep, you know. Um, but anyway, I don't know. I'm just not really a big jewelry person, so. You don't wear your ring, so yeah, that's the thing, Shella. I think a lot of folks are just not big, not big jewelry people. I don't think about it. It gets in the way of my gaming. Oh, Sh oh, that's right. Shella can't wear it, and neither can I, because it gets in the way of our gaming. Absolutely. <laughs> hey, Brayden, Dime, and Mads, and Jeff, and Marissa, and Reese, and Avalon, and Bertha, thank you for the subs. Oh, do you know what? Speaking of Dan, I might uh, force him to come pick up these. Um, I'm like, I brought the, I bought the Green Chef stuff in here for the stream, but I'm like, maybe I should get Dan to come put it in the fridge. <laughs> uh, that's probably a good idea. <laughs> I do still have, like, the ice pack in there, but, um, it probably wouldn't hurt to make Dan put it in the fridge, so. <laughs> Currently wearing seven rings. Yeah, I know some people are big into rings. I'm just not a jewelry person. I, the problem with me is that I, like, mess with it too much. This is why I can't really wear earrings because I like, I, obviously I've got headphones on so they're covering it, but uh, when I'm when I'm wearing earrings, I like pull on them to the point where I like hurt myself um, and it's not good. I just like, I just like mess with it. So it's not good. <laughs> it's not good. Um, 
one of the rules of this challenge. Oh, we can put the link in the chat for you, Tiffany, if you're interested. Um, that'll have all the rules. Dan is coming to take my stuff. That is very good. Okay, well, I can't plan a wedding because I'm not engaged. <laughs> Hello, Dan. Hey. Do you want to say hi? Hi. There's Dan. <laughs> <laughs> Bye. Okay. Careful, don't fall on the stairs, okay? Okay. I'll try not to. It would actually be so embarrassing if you did because they would probably hear it. Yeah, they would. And you'd be hurt, which wouldn't be good. <laughs> he's gone. He's gone. Anyway, um, he's bringing it to the fridge. Let's go get engaged, shall we? Speaking of rings, <laughs> let's go get engaged. Um, yeah, don't fall. You've got to see Taylor Swift tomorrow. <laughs> His leg's doing a little bit better, Ollie. It's weird. I think it still bothers him sometimes, but not always. He fell the other day. And he like, I don't know, I think he like pulled something in his leg or something really bad because it's been causing him a lot of problems, but it's it's been like a little bit better. The first day he like couldn't walk up and down the stairs, but he's been doing a little bit better. It's been like a week. What happened? I don't know. He just fell. Uh, trust me, I've been there, so I understand, <laughs> but he just fell. Where should we get engaged? The mountains. That could be fun. If we won't get married here, we can at least get engaged here. Yeah. The green chef sound is so pleasant. It doesn't scare me anymore. Well, we'll see, maybe. Earlier today, cause I had like, I had basically this, the thing he covered. I've just had this thing on my OBS, but like hidden like this. Um, and earlier today I was setting up for the stream um, and somebody used the link and bought it when I like wasn't live and the noise did terrify me. <laughs> it like shocked me cause I was just sitting here in silence like setting up for the stream and then all of a sudden it went off and I was like, <gasps> and it's not even a scary noise. It's just like a little like, it's so small, it's so faint. Why does it get me that bad? It makes no sense. I'm just jumpy, I think, is the problem. Because it's really not that deep. Like, I, I need to calm down. <laughs> okay. Oh. Um. What do you think about that? Why is she smiling down at it? And then she sniffed! She sniffed! <laughs> oh my god! You like that, Iris? You like the poop just there on the floor? Delicious. <laughs> Delicious. Ew! Okay, you need to change into your cold weather outfit so you don't die. I would like to at least have the wedding first. You can die after, but I don't want you to die before. That would inconvenience me. Okay, um, where do you want to get engaged? There's some nice places. We could maybe come like, oh, how about on this bridge? It's kind of orange. It's not orange orange, but it kind of has the right vibes. How about that? <laughs> Are you and Shella naming your Sims the same on purpose? Iris and Blaze? I didn't name Iris, she was born. And I don't know if Shella has a sim named Blaze, but if so, I did it first. Oh yeah, I didn't name Iris. I just found her. So that's a funny co coincidence. <laughs> I didn't know you had an Iris. Um, how did you and Simsy meet? Me and Shella? Um, Twitch. I don't remember when I first talked to Shella. I've got not a clue. Excuse me, sir. I'm trying to get engaged. Oh, the eco lifestyle thing. That's right. That makes sense. Um, would you like to, let's just propose. If I have to delete this guy, then I will. If I must do it, then I shall. Hold on. I need screenshots of this. She said yes! Oh, good. Oh, that's a cute picture. Congrats! Oh! Okay, well now we can get married. 
<laughs> it's about time. They've been together forever. Oh, I forgot about that one. I wonder if one of my mods could find it. Basically, they're talking about this one time. Um, there was like a visual glitch. It was in the mint gen of Not So Berry, I think, where I tried to propose to a sim. And so he like kneeled down and went to propose, except the sim was like standing over there and reacting correctly, but like they weren't facing each other. So it's like, imagine if Iris was like over here and then that random townie was stood right here still. So it looked like I was proposing to the random townie, except I wasn't. <laughs> it was such a weird bug. It was not, it was not my, my person. <laughs> anyway, uh, oh, it was Flossie and Bethany. That's right. It was the Minchin. I'm not so very. Yeah, so Flossie was trying to propose to Bethany, and Bethany was like way over here, and it just didn't work. <laughs> yeah, I've got it in my highlight reel, so a lot of you might have seen it. What are we getting from that? Deeply enamored in a winter wonderland? Oh, that's really cute. Oh. <laughs> okay, let's plan a wedding. Okay, I'm gonna do the wedding tomorrow morning. I need to do it early in the morning so I can still go to my job afterward. <laughs> Sorry, but it's true. Uh, I shall cut the cake. I shall have a dance. I shall kiss. I'll have a feast. I'll exchange vows. We're dressed. Maybe I'll make everybody wear orange. What do you guys think about that? And I will do it here on this lot at like 9 a.m. Yeah, okay. Well, I should probably ask the kids if they wanna be flower pals, but do you wanna go skiing first? <laughs> do you wanna go sledding continuously together? It might be kind of fun. We can celebrate at least. I don't know you. No. These people are so weird. Didn't invite anyone? Oh, I forgot. <laughs> Sorry. I was like, I'm gonna set this part later. I forgot to invite anybody. Um, let me invite some family. Um, Uh, that'll be the Peppa Pig costume. Did I do that? Um. Maybe I'll invite my ex. And Kyle. I didn't set the family, like my household, to be invited. But... I'll be able to, you know, ask them to be the involved in the wedding. Yeah, Peppa, that Jeffrey character is related to Bran. Um, I think that would be Bran's sibling. Are you gonna go sled? Go faster. I want to sled. What are you gonna do? Oh, you are? You're gonna sled too? Okay. Invites enemy, but not the pig? I thought I did invite the pig. Did I not? I could have sworn I did. Oh, I didn't. Listen, the thing is scary. I don't know. Well, are we all stuck in line? Aren't only the kids invited now? Are you sure? Guess three. Oh my god, I hate this game. It's stupid. I'm trying again. These are all family members. So, I'll get them invited. Kyle, Hugh, there. Yeah, I reset when I click the family filter. I don't even think he's gonna sled. Go sledding on bunny slope. Do it at least once, come on. Here we go. Why do you hate Kyle? Oh, my sim beat him up. I, I have to be evil for this generation. I'm, you know, 
I previously had finished the, uh, like, Deviant Aspirations, you know? We have the Dastardly trait from it. Did I invite Raisin? No, I'm gonna ask her to be, um, the officiant. Oh! Well, good going. Let's get a screenshot of that. That's actually a good one. Oh, ouch. Okay, let's go back home and ask family to participate in the wedding. Does she only see her subscribers' comments? No. <laughs> I can see the whole chat. It's a, I understand the, the question, but I, it does hurt my feelings a little bit that people would think that I would like only read sub chat messages. Um, obviously I'm not doing that. That would be terrible. Um, so if I wanted to have sub only mode, I could turn on a setting, but I, you know, that's not a thing that we use, you know. Um, not, not like a daily basis kind of vibe, you know? Oh, Teeny, to get the plum bobs off, I'm pressing space because the space bar uh, shifts between sims. So the plum bob goes away when you're off those sims, basically. Um, so to show you, I press the space bar and it like transfers the plum bob because it's switching the sim that I'm on. You know? Um, okay. Would you like to... Where's the kid? Do you want to ask her to be a flower pal? Ask to be flower pal at the wedding. Maybe you could ask the other one. That'll be kind of cute. Ask to be flower pal at the wedding. <laughs> yeah, and just to clarify again, just because I didn't read something out loud doesn't mean that I didn't see it. Obviously, I can't read every chat message out loud. That would be literally impossible. So don't go around thinking like, I've never read your messages because <laughs> I haven't said them out loud. That makes absolutely no sense. Um, it's just not really doable to to read everything out loud, obviously, you know? Um, you were joking? Okay, well, that's why it's useful to use tone tags because um, sometimes it's hard to tell if people are telling a joke or not when they're, you know, seemingly upset about you do not doing something, <laughs> you know? Um, okay, I think, would you like to go get ready? Not that bathroom, this one. Okay, you're getting ready. We finished, by the way, with this sim. Look at this. I finished all of the kid aspirations that come with the pack. All of these multi-skill ones, I did them all. Maybe you could try and draw two pictures while inspired. Maybe I'll have you take a thoughtful shower so we can get you inspired and then we can do it. Um, what are tone tags? Oh, we can talk about this, you guys, if you want. Let me see if I can find a link that we can pull up so I can show you. Or even just like a picture. Um, basically, this is a, a little image that shows some tone tags. Um, you can use these when you're typing things um, to like say the tone that you're trying to use. So you could, for example, if you type something sarcastic um, and it's maybe not clear that you're using sarcasm, you could put like, you know, slash J to indicate that you're joking. Or if you're being serious, you could put like slash SRS to say you're being serious. You know, you can like use these things um, to, to clarify like, what you're trying to say. Um, it can be helpful, especially when you're trying to make like, I, I think that sometimes it helps with sarcasm, especially like in Twitch chat. Um, Cause it's like, are you being mean or are you being sarcastic? You know, <laughs> um, and you can use that slash S so it's obvious that you're being sarcastic um, or that you're being genuine or whatever. Um, I don't know. It's just helpful for, for folks. So, um, but anyway, especially in text, because sometimes it's hard to read what people are trying to say. So when people talk about tone tags, that's what they mean. Um, but yeah, and then you could say like, you know, slash neg slash POS saying you're being positive or whatever, because um, then it makes it more clear again. Oftentimes for me, um, it's really hard to tell sometimes from chat because people kind of like, you know, you joke with the streamer, but sometimes like the jokes don't always land because it, like, I don't know you <laughs> and I can't like read, I only see what you're typing. And so it, that kind of thing can help. Um, what are you doing? Stop. Um, but yeah, anyway, if you're ever curious, you can uh, do some research on tone tags and see if that's something that you'd like to consider using sometimes, but it can be helpful for a lot of folks. Um, but, mm-hmm. 
Uh oh. <laughs> There's some that I always read like the wrong way too. Let me see if I can find an example. I'm like blanking on it right now. But there's some where I read it and it like, um, it makes me think that it's like not a joke when it is. It's like I, I'm reading it wrong, you know, when it's actually supposed to be like a joke. <laughs> it's like how you say you and your friends try and use slash E for endearing, but your other friend reads it as for evil. <laughs> uh oh, <laughs> that's opposite. Yeah, it's the- it's P.O.S. for positive that sometimes I read as like, you know, a bad word. <laughs> it's like it sounds like you're trying to call someone a mean thing, but it- like a piece of, you know? But that's- I always think that when I first see it, and then I'm like, no, that's not what that means. <laughs> that's always my first thought when I see it, too. Um, but anyway. <laughs> You think the same thing every time too? Yeah, I'll be like on Twitter and I'm like, oh, oh wait, every time. <laughs> yeah, we think that Capricorn, we think that we're gonna have um, Barbie as the heir. She's doing really well. She's got so many bonus traits and stuff. So anyway, Peppa? Peppa Pig, is that you? That's not a pig at all. I'm gonna keep that forever and ever. <laughs> She drew her sister! <laughs> hey Jess and Ock and Fish Tank and Peyton! Spring Sims with the 65 months! Top Taylor Swift album. Oh my god. You know what? People ask me this all the time and I change my mind so often. I feel like at this current moment, I think that I'm- I'm- I'm in a speak now era at this current moment of my life, but I- I don't know. I change my mind a lot. Oh, I'm not inspired anymore. Dang it! Go away. That stupid fine moodlet. Hmm. Guess what I'll be doing tomorrow? Seeing Taylor Swift. And listening to her sing one song off speak now. <laughs> okay, you want to play with three toys. Oh, it's after midnight. Wait! Oh, no! Oh, my God. We have to go. We're getting married at 9 a.m. Oops. Okay, um, to bed. Sorry. I was very distracted. We were talking about other things, okay? We were talking about other things. All right, you're in bed. You're in bed. No, you're not quite in bed, but you know, you're working on it. Do you know what, Allison? I have always been a Reputation stan. My sister's favorite album is Reputation. Um, my sister is into it, so. Did I get my fish yet? No, I haven't yet. They're all asleep. Let's do it in the morning. So. Did I get a wedding cake yet? No, we're gonna do it in the morning. Everybody's gotta sleep first. Otherwise, we're gonna have a nightmare time in the morning tomorrow. <laughs> we will do it, but tomorrow. <laughs> Can't decide on an era. Yeah, it's hard to pick. I'm really bad at picking favorite things. People tell me, they'll be like, oh my God, Kayla, what's your favorite color? And I'm like, I don't know. <laughs> it's like, I, I like overthink it too much. I'm like too scared to declare one. Even though like I obviously have like colors that I like the best. I'm like, I don't know, I can't pick. <laughs> I don't like to choose a favorite thing. It's too stressful. How am I supposed to know? I like a lot of things. It, it feels like too final to do, like say that's my favorite one, you know? Cause what if it, it might change? So I just, I don't know. <laughs> yeah, a color palette is good over a single color. Yeah, I like that. That's a better option. You didn't finish sleeping. I guess you're bathing. That's probably for the best. You could probably order me a cake in the morning too cause you'll be up first. The amount of graves is modest. Yeah, Michelle, I only got a couple. Just a couple of graves, one or two. Would your palette be pastels? I do love a pastel, so probably. Good option. Oh no. Hold on. <laughs> I just realized, I don't think that I um, uploaded the video that Dan needs to edit right now to the 
to the drive, so that's not good. Did I put it in the wrong folder? Wait, sorry, chat. This is not ideal. Um, maybe if I put it in the wrong place? Oh no, I did not put it in the wrong place. Um, what's the option? Let me get a hard drive and then we can put it on there. This is, um, welcome to my, that's not where it is. Uh, chat, I can't find it. Chat. This drawer only has stickers. I don't know why I opened that thinking I was gonna find anything useful. Hold on. <laughs> this is not good. I think it's in this bottom drawer. Yeah, here we go. This will do. This will do. Sticker drawer. Well, it's actually like stationary, basically. What's the problem? Oh, I just have to give Dan the raw footage of a video to edit. He has to edit it before, um, he has to edit before we leave, obviously, because we're going to a concert. Um, okay, let me put it on there for him. That sounds good to me, videos. Sorry that you have to watch this chat. Um, again, we're, we're learning stuff about each other together. <laughs> oh, that was my computer, sorry. <laughs> Hey, Gabby, Moss, Olivia, and Kayla, and Jess, thank you for the subs. 0% complete copying. Hmm. That's not good. Oh, here we go. 1% complete copying. 2% complete copying. 3% complete copying. <laughs> okay, well, <laughs> well, that does that. And while my sims are getting up and ready, um, have you guys heard about our sponsor today, Green Chef? <laughs> No, honest, serious, if you guys didn't know, Green Chef is sponsoring the stream today, uh, and they're offering a pretty huge discount foot code to you all. Um, you get 60% off uh, if you buy it, and free shipping using our code or our link. Um, so if you're interested in checking it out, it's um, it's like a meal delivery service, meal kit delivery service, where they send you the ingredients and the recipe for, uh, for dinner, and then you can cook it, um, and you can pick all your options and stuff. It's really good. They have a lot of, a lot of meals, a lot of good options for different people's like dietary needs. Like for example, they have a lot of vegan and vegetarian stuff, um, which is good for me. And all their things are certified organic. So, <laughs> okay, anyway, now 19%. Excellent. <laughs> uh, hey, Steph and Gabby and Balls, thank you so much. Uh, let me tell Dan. Um, it will be done soon. It's gonna take a while, isn't it? It really is. Thought you were not live today? Oh yeah, Strawberry, I usually stream in the mornings on Wednesdays. Um, but today, um, today we're live a little bit, uh, later than normal, because I'm gonna be live in the morning tomorrow instead. I'm going to a Taylor Swift concert tomorrow, so I'm gonna stream in the morning before I leave. So. <laughs> I don't know, Danny. I they're mostly joking, but it's kind of mean. So <laughs> it's also a really tired joke. Like we get it. Me and Dan have very similar hair color. Okay, thank you. <laughs> You've seen it a lot of times. <laughs> you don't need to say it again. Um, but anyway, whatever. It does not bother me. It's just it's more so annoying that like so many of them say it, and they act like it's original. <laughs> Yeah, this is burnt. I'm never gonna fix it. I kind of like it being ruined. Okay, would you like to ask Raisin to be... Hello. It's not done copying yet, Dan. I'll just wait. 49%. It's being very slow. Oh, she made cupcakes. I was gonna ask her to be the officiant, but officiants never work, so maybe I'll ask her to be a Civ of Honor instead. Let's try that. Good, she didn't say no. <laughs> That's a relief. Okay. Oh no! I can't edit it now because... It's already technically started because it starts in less than an hour. Okay, well we know what we did. We asked them... Everything's fine. Everything's fine. I'm fine. Are all of our needs okay? You're gonna eat cupcakes? That's so annoying. 
It's not my fault that it took so long to find her. Oh yeah, I'll bring her with us. It's not a problem. I'm not worried about that. It's more just annoying that I couldn't set it. My friend needs to see pulp. Can we get a pulp cam? Yeah, 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 yeah. Dan, do you want to see this? See what? Pulp. Oh, hey. It's really cute. Yeah? Mm-hmm. <laughs> That's probably the word that I would use, too. And the wiggly tail. Yeah, she's a little scary, but it's okay. In a bridge. <laughs> no, this is the second time today this person's asked me my best friend. Oh, yeah. Go away. All right, I think we're okay for the wedding though. Aside from that, everybody's needs are good. <gasps> Cake! Oh no, 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 no. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Order, more choices. Purchase wedding cake. It still is at 90%. Sorry, chat. Is any, are any of these orange? Um, that one's orange and purple. That's not terrible. We might have to use that one. That's okay. That'll do. All right, now it's wedding time. Now it is wedding time. 98% complete, 99% complete. 100% complete. There we go. Okay, here you go. Sorry, that's my computer, not yours. <laughs> Every time I do that, I always feel bad. Bye like it's gonna scare people. Bye, Dan. Did you say bye, Dan, or bye again? Bye again. Oh, I thought you were saying bye, Dan. <laughs> bye, Dan. <laughs> anyway, now he's gotta go edit that. Have fun. <laughs> Moon and Say and Morningstar and AJ and Perkley and Alpha, thank you for the subs. Oh, they did all wear orange. Okay, I gave you special outfits for this though, so you don't have to wear that. You can wear the pink that I put you in. Oh my gosh. Wow, we took this orange thing seriously. We got orange socks on and everything. Huh. I like it. MC dresser, change outfit, formal, there. Okay, now we're ready. That isn't what I wanted you to wear. MC dresser, change outfit, there we go. Now we're ready. Okay, um, where do I have space for the, okay, the cake can go right here. I'm gonna bring pulp here and then we should be okay. Yay, Raisin can wear purple if she wants. That's fine. That's fine, okay. Should we just exchange the vows? Oh, I like your dress. That's a nice one. I say we just go for it, to be honest. Exchange vows and kiss. Don't forget to put a topper so no one eats the cake early. Oh. It'll be fine. If they eat the cake, they eat the cake. I'll deal with it. <laughs> we'll try and be fast. We'll try and be fast. <laughs> no, you don't need to use an officiant. You can exchange vows. There's a few options. So it, it says like, uh, exchange vows alone, exchange vows and kiss, exchange vows with officiant, exchange vows with officiant and kiss. So you can pick if you want to do it alone, if you don't want to kiss, if you do want to kiss. Um, you, you pick, Thanks. basically with these. Okay. Let's, uh, get a lovely screenshot of this going. Okay. You never have them sit first? Yeah, because it doesn't work, so I just don't bother with it. Oh my- That's new. I don't know. I don't know. I think I was too close. So, oops. <laughs> Whoa, fancy ring exchange. 
Nobody watched. I didn't call them over. But, oh, that was pretty. I should have stayed to watch that. Okay, that part's done. Let's cut the cake. I'm trying to be fast because I have to go to work later. We can gather for the cake part. Feed cake to Blaze. Venue is so cute. Yeah, I made this. I built this, um, I think right when Wedding Stories came out. The cake is the best part, in my opinion. It's so cute. Look. Isn't that adorable? Oh, oh! That was unnecessary. What time does he go to work? Six. Okay, we got a lot of time. We'll be fine. We'll be fine. I just want to make sure he goes into work today because I'm trying to get promoted. <laughs> I'm trying to get promoted, so we need to make sure we go into work. Um, let me buy a camera as well. Let's see, we can get a little tripod. I'll try and take some cute wedding photos. TV dots, move objects on. Literally, if someone smashed fake, fake, if someone smashed cake into my face on my wedding day, I would be so furious. <laughs> Oh, I would never let that go. Absolutely never let that go. Um, actually, just take a picture with her, honestly. It'll be easier. Only two sims to worry about. Oh, the kids have decided to come wait, it seems. Are you gonna take the picture? This picture thing is so glitchy. Come on. Come on. Take a picture with Blaze. Come on. Are you gonna do it? You gonna do it? Oh my god. The way we have to reset like three times before it works. Um, reset object. Okay. We'll get at least one wedding photo. Promise. Why are you standing there? I want it. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. Oh, that's cute. Okay, this will be fine. It's a nice little wedding photo. I just want a couple. Um, I want something like, I always have that one. Maybe I'll pick something different. I don't know, I'm kind of trying to randomize through all of them, but this might be okay. Um, yeah, how about that? One vertical, one horizontal, yes? Okay, that's good. I got my photos. Do you wanna do your first dance? <laughs> oh, there's a missing wallpaper. Yeah, Pyle, um, usually I stream in the morning on Wednesdays, but I'm going to a Taylor Swift concert tomorrow, so I'm streaming in the morning tomorrow instead. <laughs> we can be best friends with our brother. You can't be family-oriented, sorry. Come on, let's dance. Please? Please, I want some cute ones. Oh, look how adorable! I like how it's private, to be honest. It's kind of cute. Place is really cute. How excited are you? I'm so excited, Riley. Although I will say, the the anxiety is kicking up a little. <laughs> I'm starting to get a little bit nervous about it. Um, I think just because like, oh, can you take a picture of, wait, I want a picture of Blaze and Pulp at the wedding. Anyway, I'm starting to get a little bit anxious about it. <laughs> I think as you can probably imagine, um, I was just starting to get a little bit nervous um, with the uh, leading up to it, <laughs> so. <laughs> Are you actually gonna take the picture with Pulp? Oh my God, I hate the photo system in this game. It's so stupid. Do I have an outfit planned? Oh yeah! 
Definitely. <laughs> I'm ready. Um, I'm just a little bit scared. <laughs> um. Are you begging for food right now? You guys, this is what I'm talking about. When I say Pulp is like the single greatest Sims dog of all time, this is just unmatched. How? Like, how do you look like that? Is the venue far at all? Yeah, it's in Tampa. I live in Orlando, so it's like two hours away. How are you real? It's just amazing. Okay, I'm gonna go home. I've gotten enough of my wedding today. <laughs> I'm ready to return home. <laughs> I've had enough, I've had enough, okay? I've just had enough. <laughs> do you know what we need to do? So we've talked about now that, um, why is Raisin not in this list? We've talked about now that the household's a little bit smaller. It's probably time that we have Pulpies. Pulp. Puppies. You have so many screenshots of pulp. Oh, you have no idea. <laughs> I take so many. Whenever I get off stream, I go back and I look for like any screenshots I took to use as the thumbnail for the VOD on YouTube. And it's like, they're all pulp. Maybe one like selfie my Sims took and then all pulp. Kayla. <laughs> my mods chat right now is just pulp. Dika just keeps sending pictures of pulp right now. It's all pulp. Everywhere. Anyway, I want to have puppies with pulp. Um, I just... Do we need to make another dog? Is that like the situation? What dog should we use? Oh, what Adopt you? another one? I don't know if we want it to be random though. I think that it might need to be calculated. So we gotta think about this. I think it needs to be a small dog. But... Randomize three times? That's an idea. A corgi might be interesting. That might be an idea. A wiener dog? Oh. You might be onto something with that. Play with genetics maybe for another dog i think i want to have puppies for real because i haven't had puppies for real in game in a long time we do want the puppies to look like pulp but i don't necessarily need them to be like exactly like pulp oh no <gasps> oh my game almost crashed i don't need them to be identical to pulp I want it to be like... I mean, it's just not as good. It'll never be as good. save this to my gallery just for later
We, we can worry about this later. I need that though. Yeah, I'll get that into like its own household soon. All right, I think that we should do it with this dog. I think, should anything be done to like, Listen, Pulp has really big eyes too, so we could always like really embrace it. That'll be fine. Okay, let's see if we can get them to have puppies. On their treats that age pets down. Yeah, we've already used one on Pulp. Pulp should probably be dead by now. Pulp is not dead. So, because I aged Pulp down when they became an elder. We were given too much power with the customization tool for pets. <laughs> we should be allowed to do this. It's too much, it's too much. Oh my God, Kayla. No, guys, we gotta go back and cast. I need you to see my dog. Hold on, wait, hold, once this loads, I'm gonna go, I'll show you some screenshots. Um, I, I have this dog called Pulp, who is the single best dog that was ever created in The Sims 4. Wait, I didn't even make them. I just adopted them. You need to see this. I've taken a bunch of Pulp screenshots today. What do we got? Oh, here we go. Um, this is Pulp. So, let me show you up close the real thing. Uh-oh. 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 Do you see what I mean, though? Do you understand what I'm trying to say? There's never been anything better. I don't know. It's really amazing. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. <laughs> I'm just in awe. How is it real? But do you understand? Do you understand? You should understand. Anyway, I'm trying to have puppies because I would like for this pulp thing to really continue on. I don't remember how to do it. I want to like encourage you to have, yeah, encourage to mate with this one. Come on. Did it work? Did it work? Ooh. Ew, he's licking. Did it work? Oh my god, hi Molly. <laughs> um, I'm not pregnant, do it again. Let me get a woohoo bush. I don't think it worked. Uh, I'm currently, hold on. I gotta show you something in a second, Molly, but I just need to like, I just need to, um, I just need to make sure I'm having puppies. 
Can we see Pope again? Is that its name? Yeah, hold on. I just took so many more screenshots. Wait, wait, wait. Look, 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 look. Here's Pope. right? Greatest dog of all time. There's never been anything better. Anyway, how was your stream? <laughs> Thanks for the raid, both of you. Um, I'm glad that you could be here for this moment. Because my game's lagging. Oh no, I need to save. Also, Molly, um, you'll be very pleased to know that tomorrow I'm going to a Taylor Swift concert. <laughs> tomorrow and on Friday. This time tomorrow, I will be there. This time tomorrow. <sighs> uh, it'll be starting in like an hour and a half from now tomorrow. The openers will be. Oh my God. <laughs> I'm so excited. I've literally never been so excited for anything in my entire life. I feel like I've been waiting for this moment my entire life since I was a child, an actual child. So anyway, I'm very excited. Um, are you pregnant or not? What's happening here? Where'd the other dog go? Well, I checked and she wasn't pregnant. Do we have to... Do we have to wait or can you see it in there right away? Can I go into Cass and, oh, make pregnant debug. Can I go into Cass and see if it lets me like fix her? It's not instant. Even, but like, even with human Sims, like it doesn't tell you instantly, but you're still marked as pregnant. I'm a Narsco. You know? huh? It lets me... I don't know if it worked. Do I need a doghouse in the lot? Oh, there is no doghouse in The Sims 4. Is one of them spayed or fixed? No, neither of them are. There is no doghouse in The Sims 4 though, so. Are we sure they can breed? Yeah, I just, I just made them. So yeah. It'll be, it'll be okay. It's not like urgent. We got time. Don't think they actually did it. That's what I'm thinking. I don't think it actually worked either. You have a cried on stream count? It's not real. The command just works like whenever somebody does it, it counts up. So it's, I haven't actually cried on stream like 2000 times or whatever the thing says. <laughs> that would be a little excessive, okay? That would be a lot. I've not done it that much. I've definitely cried on stream, but not 2000 times. Encourage to mate with. Let's do it again. Maybe it'll work this time. Try again. Try again. Let me save. Doesn't matter that Pulp was aged down. No, Pulp get, got the aged down treat, but it, much like with adult sims, it doesn't, I mean, as long as we've like, as long as they're an adult, it'll be fine. Why are you not working? Please. 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 Nicole, did you really get to? I feel like I have been such a huge fan of Taylor Swift for literally like what feels like my entire life, right? <laughs> um, I've never been to one of her concerts though, so I'm really excited um, for the chance to go. I know I keep telling this story, but like, my first ever CD that I got for Christmas was a gift of from my grandpa of her music because my grandpa was a huge Taylor Swift fan too. And like, I just, I don't know. I'm gonna be very emotional tomorrow. <laughs> okay, well, uh, guess that I won't be encouraging the dogs to mate right now because he left. Can you do it? I don't think you're close enough to the dogs. 
Um, maybe I'll cheat it. So that I can make them have babies. Wait! Oh, they're doing it! It did work! Oh. work straight away if it worked I can see I was right we're having pulpies and we're gonna have two so I can keep the good ones okay I need to get rid of Charlie now <laughs> I'm gonna send him to go live with um, my brother or something I don't care about Charlie. I just, I'm not interested. I'm... <laughs> I love when Simpsy aggressively tells chat that she was right. Oh, is that what it came across as? <laughs> Me aggressively telling chat that I was right? That's no good. Oh, do you know what? This Sim is Iris's sister. I could, where does she live? Windenburg? I could give, I could give Charlie to Iris's sister. That would make sense. She has a cat too. Yeah, I think that I think that makes sense. So then Charlie's still here, still in the family. But you know. Can I give you the vibes of your concert outfit? Well, I have three ideas and I'm going to two concerts. So the first one um, I have this, like, pink shirt, um, and these, like, little heart earrings, and I think I might wear that tomorrow, um, so I'm probably gonna do that, uh, and then I've got two dress options that I might wear on, oh, oh, I wore one of them on Easter, though, so I just posted on Instagram in it, so I probably shouldn't wear it again. I'm gonna wear, the other one that I'm gonna wear on Friday is the dress that I wore on my birthday. I've got an Instagram picture on it, so let me show you. Instagram.com forward slash Lil Simsy. But I think this will be good. It's black and white. No, 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 let me in. Okay, I can't show you that easily. But here, I'll just zoom in because Instagram is being annoying. Um, it's this one. Oh, you can't see my face. That one I think I'm gonna wear. Be an outfit repeater, bestie. I can't be an outfit repeater two Instagram posts in a row though. But I like that dress. Um, and I think that it'll be good. And I can wear it with some sneakers and it'll be comfortable and easy to wear for a concert. So. <laughs> um, okay. I think that I would like to get some leftovers. Oh, are you working hard? Okay, good. Good. What if it rains? Well, if it rains, then we'll see. <laughs> it's It might rain tomorrow. Um, I'm hoping that it won't rain during the concert. It's looking better, but we shall see. Oh, I'm gonna wear shorts under the dress. I'm not stupid, don't worry. <laughs> I never wear a dress without shorts under it. <laughs> um, I'm gonna wear like, uh, basically like under it, but wow. short ones, so you won't be able to see it. Um, you live in Tampa? No, I live in Orlando. Tampa's like two hours away, so. Um, oh, expecting puppies! Expecting pulpies! Yes! Anyway, my thought process, here's my thought process, right? So tomorrow, I'm driving down to Tampa, and then I'm gonna check into my hotel, change, and then go to the concert, yes? Um, and... The plan is that tomorrow I'm gonna wear like the shirt and jeans to the concert. Yes, it's gonna be cute. I've got a good combo, it's nice. And then on Friday, because we're going to drive home straight after the concert, I'm gonna wear the dress because it'll be more comfortable when I'm driving home at like midnight. 
them wearing jeans in the car. What's wrong with the dog? Oh, she just looks like that. So. <laughs> <laughs> That's my, uh, my plan, so. <laughs> oh, I'm not driving home after night two. My family is driving home after night two, because listen, my, um, my parents and my siblings are coming with me on Friday, and so there will be a lot of us, all with licenses, and I will not be the one driving. That is my brother and my dad's problem. <laughs> What are Pulp's pronouns? Do you know what? I use them all. Any pronouns for Pulp. All work, all are good. So, is your brother a Swifty? Um, yeah. I think I've rubbed off on him enough. I've been working on it for a long time. Like, a really long time. So. <laughs> I've been really trying for a long time. So, I think it's hard to not be. Boss's birthday. Ooh. Order a present online. Good. Wait, why are you asleep? I'm not paying attention. Um... Would you like to get leftovers? Hide in a closet. Performance gain medium. Oh, that's good. How are you doing? Not good enough. All right, how's your aspiration going? You need to play with three toys. Maybe I could like, let me try. See if we can get a move on. Oh, I can't use that one because it's stuck. Use this one instead. <laughs> Um, are the heart earrings like suds or dangly? Oh, they're dangly. Dangly heart earrings. Um, I would like to play with this and then this as well. See if we can get all three toys complete. Does that count? As playing with one toy? She needs to pee? Yeah, she'll be fine. Don't worry about it. That's one. Well, technically two total now, but. Can we add a slide to the treehouse? Oh yeah, I probably should. I probably should, but I haven't yet. Maybe tomorrow I'll work on it during the day. It's a concert in an open space. Yeah, um, let me show you the stadium. Raymond James Stadium. She is open open so open <laughs> um completely <laughs> open <laughs> so anyway is it thought it was covered so you didn't plan for rain oh yeah she's not covered at all doesn't get more open than that yeah Open. <laughs> okay, are you gonna probably just go to sleep to be honest? <laughs> okay. Do I have good seats? Yeah, we're sitting in the lower bowl, so I'm very excited. Very excited. I actually could start crying just thinking about it. Yeah, I don't think it is gonna rain tomorrow. It looks like it was maybe gonna rain tomorrow all week, um, and I was really stressed about it, but I don't think it is. So, oh, terrified. Me too, Bessie. <laughs> Are we having puppies? Oh yeah. Oh, Pulp, did you eat? Eat. What are you doing? In 2011, you sat in the front row at her speak now to her. Shut up, Miv. I'm really jealous. <laughs> I'm so sad that I haven't been to one of her concerts before. So sad. So, so, so sad. It's okay. Now is my chance. Now is my chance. Okay. 
Are you fine? What are you doing here? This is one of the kids' friends. It's 2.30 in the morning. Smarly, do you want to talk about being sad about missing the reputation tour? She was in Tampa on my birthday. I didn't go. I was too scared. I didn't go. I didn't go to concerts. I was too scared. I'm, listen. Isn't that the worst thing ever? <laughs> Isn't that so painful? I think Pulp's not doing okay. Um, Rach, a lot of artists come to Orlando, but uh, artists like Taylor Swift usually go to Tampa and Miami because they have like a big football stadium like that. Um, we have an arena, but we have like, we're talking like 20,000 people here and the, you know, these stadiums are like 60, 70,000 people. <laughs> um, so usually like people like Taylor Swift wouldn't come to Orlando, so. Um, but like I've seen like Justin Bieber <laughs> here. <laughs> Actually, I saw Justin Bieber a year ago yesterday in Orlando. It was actually really fun. But yeah, people like Taylor Swift don't usually come to Orlando. Yeah, only 20,000, right? Yeah. <laughs> Um, it's amazing how much of a difference that is. Um. <laughs> oh, really, Avery? That's really nice of you to say. <laughs> how many people live in Orlando? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Population of Orlando. This says 309,000. What about, like, the Or Orlando metro area? 2.6 million as of 2019. I'm one of them. <laughs> okay, I'm saving just to be safe again. Okay, good. Well, while my sims are all asleep- Oh my god, again? She's burnt out always. While my sims are all asleep, um, have you- Oh my god! What? Already? What do I do? How do I help her? Pulp? Oh my god. Do I just wait? Oh, Pulp. I'm so worried for you. Okay, okay, okay. 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 Um, do you want to give Pulp a bath? Or is now not a good time? That might help her. A big pet bed helps speed it up? Okay. I'll get one after I do this. Nope, I can't. I'm giving birth. No, nope, wait, maybe I'm gonna... Who knows? Oh, uh, Poshma. I guess we just wait. I'll just wait. I gave her better needs as well. Okay, do you wanna get some food? I'm scared. <gasps> okay. What do I do? What do we do? What do we call it? What do we call it? Juice? <laughs> like orange juice? Zest! Zest! Come on. And. Tangy? <laughs> like Animal Crossing. We should we call it Tangy? I kind of like that. 
It's not as chaotic as pulp. But it is good. I'm doing it. Okay, so neither of them have Pulp's face. Maybe they will. I guess they're only puppies, huh? They look almost too normal. It's a little bit worrying, I'm not gonna lie. I'm sure it'll be fine. But... The dad was too long nose though. Well, the dad had a long nose, but it's it's not like a you know, it's it's a 50-50 in the Sims genetics. It's like you'll have her nose or his nose. Age them up and cast. Should we or should we wait until it's like actually time? You still haven't played with the third toy? Oh my god, just do it. I think we should wait also. You want to see them now? Well, they won't- it won't take that long for them to age up. They're- they're pretty quick. Okay, you need to go practice. That's important. But yeah, it shouldn't- it shouldn't be too bad. Um, what do you want to do? Stargaze? Okay, you can't do that yet. You could- Oh! <laughs> Sorry! <laughs> Somebody just bought Green Chef! We still got code! Uh, I was gonna say, but then Pulp went into labor, so I got so distracted. Um, if you guys aren't familiar with Green Chef, they are actually sponsoring our stream today, which is so, so generous of them. Um, they've offered a huge discount code. You can get 60% off and free shipping if you're interested. Uh, basically, it's a meal kit delivery service, and they have a ton of options. Um, they're certified organic, and they have a lot of, like, vegan vegetarian options, so if that's, like, a need for you. By the way, that's not, like, the majority of their options. They have, like, all kinds of food options, but it's good for me that they have good veggie options because... Um, you know, need them. <laughs> so, um, it's, uh, really cool. It's a huge discount and it's so convenient as well. Um, I'm very excited to have it in May because I'm going to be so busy and streaming so much during our charity event that it's going to be very useful to not have to worry about meal planning and just have like easy, healthy things ready to cook. So I was when a hundred people order Green Chef, there isn't like a event that happens with the Green Chef bar. That's just an asset they wanted me to use on the stream um, to track people downloading it. Downloading it. <laughs> to track people using it. There's not like a, there isn't like a, you know, thing that happens, but I do get paid for each person that uses it. So <laughs> I guess, I mean, that happens. Um, but <laughs> I guess that's a win for me. Um, but anyway, that's how it works. So we have a link in the chat. The code is poglilsimzy, APR60. Don't worry about typing that. Because that's kind of complicated. Um, it's like, it's through stream elements. They're like, sometimes like, basically those would be like agencies that do, um, that do sponsor stuff on stream. And stream elements is a brand that does a lot of it. And they're the ones that make the codes. And they put pog in like all of them. I think they're trying to appeal to gamers. Which I am one, so. Yeah, they've got like gluten-free, keto, they have paleo options, they've got um, all kinds of stuff. Um, I, I keep talking about the vegan options because that's what appeals to me the most, obviously, but um, definitely worth checking out if you're if you're curious, so. Um, uh, they've got a lot of good options, so. We are hardcore gamers, you're so right. <laughs> you are so right. If there's one word that I would use to describe myself, um, it's hardcore gamer. Would you like to get some leftovers maybe? Can you get up to? What are you doing? React to dog birth. Oh, it's too late. You slept through it. Oh. Good going. Um, maybe I could hug Pulp. <laughs> After everything she's been through? Probably. Can you see the puppies? Yeah, we haven't really gotten that up close of a look at them. This is the first one. I don't know its name yet. Doesn't look that scary, unfortunately. This is Zest, okay. 
But it might be different when we age up, you know? Hard to tell. And then this one, this one is tangy. Not scary yet. This one has potential. This one definitely has potential. Oh, <laughs> sorry. Every time that number that sound plays, there's a sound that plays when people use the um, the code. It's like on that thingy. It scares me every time. I don't know why. It's not even loud. It's like not scary. I just, <laughs> I'm just jumpy. Um, okay. Well, what do you need to work on? Maybe you could come bake us something. Bum, bum, bum. Do you want to make something good? Like chocolate souffle? Perhaps? Teach Peppa to ride a bike. Ooh. Level nine creativity skill. Oh my goodness. We're going to finish this aspiration too. How long till the pulpies age up? Ooh, good question. Two days. So not that long, but we, we finished so many aspirations. <laughs> we did all four of the new ones that came with the pack with this Sim and she's gonna finish this one. And maybe even another one, cause we still have three days. My internet died and I missed pulpies. Oh my God, Christine, I'm so sorry. <laughs> it's okay. Um, be careful hitting level 10 creativity. It'll reset the adult skills. Oh no. Does it really do that? That's stupid. I, like as a glitch, right? We'll have to keep track of what level we have. Huh. Well, I got it, so. <laughs> I don't think that it- Oh, it did reset my piano skill. Look, it went back to one. I was on three. Should I put it back? Is that fair? Yeah, I think so. Oh, weird. Well, we maxed that. I also played instruments for five. Oh my god. <laughs> Someone else used the code. Thank you so much. Um, she wants to draw all five picture types on the activity table. So we can go work on that too. Let's save. Um, hey, Aaron, Anna, Ham, Man, and Sage Swift. Thank you all for the subs. Um, <laughs> what cheat did I use? Oh, um, that's a cheat that comes with a mod called MC Command Center. No, with UI Cheats Extension, sorry. I don't know why I said MC Command Center. That's not right. UI Cheats Extension is how you can cheat stuff by clicking on it. Um, hence, like, UI Cheats, like, you can click on the UI in various places um, to cheat things, like, all this stuff. So, that's how that works. Um, okay. How are your skills doing? You need a bunch of charisma skill as well. Level nine baking, level eight charisma. Those are the two that we need for our job. Are they gonna be teens soon? Um, they'll be teens in three days in game. So, that is the plan. Not sure if I read your sub. Oh, Mary, did I not say it? Oh my God, I'm so sorry. Mary, thank you for the 22 months. I missed a couple in the middle there. I missed Bearded Iris and Rachel and Megan and Icy as well. I'm so sorry if I didn't say yours, you guys. I Look, in my defense, the last 20 minutes or so, I've been really, really distracted by pulp. I always am, but today, more so than usual. <laughs> Did I cheat to make it so that Brandon and Raisin loved each other or should I just make it happen on my own? Oh, so like Brandon and Raisin could get back together after the divorce? No, I didn't cheat that. Um, we just played it. Uh, we didn't have to cheat that one to get it. We just played with them until they got it. Um, do you wanna add me a slide? Cause I would like one. Did we get new pets? Oh yeah, Pulp had puppies. Yeah. Is Peppa untalented? No, Peppa has a lot of skills. 
She doesn't have as many as the other one, but she's getting there. Here, do you want to do your school project? That could be good for you. Oh, you have to pee. Okay, well, you have to do this painting first. Wasn't there a birthday pop-up earlier? Oh, not for these two. Their birthday isn't happening yet. Um, still got a couple days till their birthday. Take my word for it. Mm -hmm. Um, you can use the bathroom. Come on. Work for Blaze starts in about an hour. Oh, we have work again today? Oh, I forgot we had two work days in a row. Oh, come eat. We might be able to get promoted. It's unlikely. But there's potential. There is potential. Um. <laughs> okay. No, 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 eat! Oh, no, we're going to work. Okay, we're going to work and we didn't eat. That's fine, that's fine. We're gonna hopefully get promoted. Work hard, okay, good. What are you up to? You gonna eat too? And then we can go back and work on the next pictures. Why did it not count as making the monster one? I thought I finished it. I did a finished monster drawing. That's rude. That's rude. Matt, I'm sorry if I missed it. Thank you for the sub. Uh, how many days does Raisin have left? Let's find out. Wait. Performance gain medium. Oh, that's really good. That'll help us. Raisin has... Oh, she went in the treehouse. Get out! Raisin has... Um... Eight days left. So we got a lot of time. Don't need to worry about it yet. Is that a whole y front yard of graves? Oh, yeah. Welcome. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> sure is. Sure is. <laughs> Are you, Olivia? That's so sweet. I'm so excited. Are you going to be there, Frog? Oh, that's really exciting. Um, I can't wait. Just a couple of graves out front. We're up to 200. 226, actually. Yeah. Don't sit. I wanna... No, don't clean up. I wanna do another one of them. Backs away slowly. <laughs> what? What's wrong with my stuff? Do you guys not like it? <laughs> do you know what? Finale, everybody keeps asking me that. Like, oh, what song do you hope she sings? I've got a, a few that I would love for her to sing, but to be perfectly honest with you, I will be so happy, literally, no matter what she sings as her, as her surprise songs tomorrow. I don't think there's a single one that she could sing that I would be like, darn, you know, like, um, so I will, I will be happy no matter what. I'm almost too scared to say what I want out loud, though. <laughs> Yeah, it's like there's a couple that I would really love to hear, but I I won't be disappointed, so. Okay, I sent the pulpies outside to pee on the patio. Get leftovers. Come on. Oh, you can't because that one is. Are you almost done? Oh, you finished that one. Wait, I only have one more to draw, so you have to do it. Draw vehicle. Then you can go to bed, sorry. Come on. Wait, you don't have 226 graves in your front yard? I mean, I can't possibly imagine why you wouldn't. <laughs> Let me take the decorations down. I don't want these Harvest Fest ones up anymore. Okay, you're eating. You could probably just go to sleep. Um, you should probably go to sleep. HOA requires at least 200 graves in the front yard. Yeah, can confirm. <laughs> oh, don't worry, Pirate. The Pulpies thing happened so fast. I think she was only pregnant for like one day in game. It was wild. It all happened so fast. <gasps> I got promoted and I finished the aspiration. Oh my god. <laughs> 
Okay, we now work uh, Sunday, Monday, Thursday. We got a huge bonus. And she finished another aspiration. Look at this. I finished all the multi-skill ones. I finished the creativity one. How much more could we possibly need to do? So, in the not so berry challenge, um, the kids, so, okay, this generation, the pink generation, we need to do the postcard collection, writing and wellness skills, the best-selling author aspiration, have a garden, and quit our day job as an adult to pursue our dreams of writing. Um, so, maybe, like, the... I don't know. I guess we need to do the wellness skill. So would motor help us? Build adult physical skills faster? Does that count? I guess it doesn't really matter. Mental is wellness too. Oh, is mental wellness? Hmm. Play games of chess, jungle gym. We can do mental, this will be easy. I don't know if we'll finish another aspiration, um, cause they do age up in what, two days and we have to go to school obviously, so. Are you going to do any giveaway codes? Do you know what Bella, I don't have any giveaway codes today. Um, we, do oh, no I didn't mean to do that. Um, we do give away codes sometimes on stream. I have a stack of them that I've been saving, that I've bought slowly, because um, we're gonna do a bunch of charity streams in May. Literally the entire month of May, we're gonna be doing a charity event. So I've been kind of trying to like, hold on and save the codes that I've been buying, um, so that we have like stuff for special streams during our charity event, if that makes sense. Um, so hopefully we'll be able to have them for that. Um, okay. We don't have to go to school. Well, well. <laughs> okay, everybody's asleep. Let me save the game again. Hoping for some luxury party and spooky day. Oh my God. <laughs> what are my kit predictions? I don't know. The boxes are kind of throwing me. I'm, I'm wondering if it's gonna be another clutter kit of some sort based on that, but I don't really know. Um, I made a whole video yesterday where I kind of talked about some thought processes that I was having. Um, I was getting like 70s vibes, gardening vibes, and maybe clutter vibes. I don't know. I'm hoping they're going to be build kits though. You think a greenhouse kit? Yeah, I mean, it was a leaf with a house on top. So like, it's kind of screaming greenhouse to me. <laughs> it was, the icon was kind of like... You know, <laughs> um, but I, I'm really curious to see what it ends up actually being. Is that puppy barking at me? Stop. Stop. Yeah, I love the idea of a greenhouse kit. That would be so fun. Um, we'd probably get some good windows out of something like that too. So gardening is still super good for you. Oh no. Do you know what? I was just thinking. Um, speaking of gardening, so the next generation Barbie, um, we have to live in a Barbie dream house, yes? Well, we don't have to, but that's kind of what we're thinking. But I'm also trying to think, like, where we want to live. We haven't really considered that yet. We have to be a writer and have a garden, yeah? So, like, should we move out to, like, Henford on Bagley and have a farm? Should we have, like, a farm? vibes going on so we can have the garden or is that like a fa we don't need to have a farm we need to have like a garden i don't know del sol valley don't say those words to me i don't want to hear it i'm anti del sol valley <laughs> it's not for me it's not for me <laughs> tartosa could be interesting i don't know We'll have to see. I'm not really sure. Oh! 9,420 for bills. Wait, what's happening to you? Zest is very hungry. Okay, then eat. 
I don't know what to tell you. That's your fault. I do love Brindleton Bay. Do you know what? If it ends up being a greenhouse kit, what amazing timing would that be for that to like probably come out? Hey, greenhouse green chef. Someone just bought green chef. Um, <laughs> what amazing timing would it be for like, if there is a greenhouse kit that comes out in the next couple of months, that's probably gonna work out really well for when we're gonna need our sim to age up, you know? Pulp, do you wanna eat or not? Call pet to eat. Pulp! No, the food's not old. I think that maybe there's just too many sims trying to eat. I'll fix it, don't worry. Make happy, okay. Okay. Tartosa, Henford on Bagley, Brindleton Bay. I'm actually kind of leaning towards Brindleton Bay or Henford on Bagley, I think. Um, I don't know. Give me the pigs. If we had pigs in that game, that would in this game, that would be kind of cute. Pigs are kind of cute. Um, okay. I think. Why are we doing a farm? Oh, because the pink generation, they have to have a a garden. That's one of the rules of the pink gen is they have to have a garden. So. Three thousand chickens. Well, you know, I I probably won't have. 3,000 chickens in my, in my build. Um, I, I'm, I'm not really leaning towards that. I don't know. What? Why not? I, you know, I, I don't know. It's just not really my dream right now. Oh my god. Uh, why? Well, I know why, but why? Why are you in there? <gasps> Should I let her die? I've got sprinklers. It'll probably help her before it's too late. Wait. She's not under the sprinklers. I'm feeling really conflicted right now. Time is running out. What do I do? Do I save her or no? I'm seeing a lot of really conflicting opinions in the chat right now. Oh, there's a poll. Okay. You decide if she lives or dies. I'll let you vote. I'm not gonna unpause the game until you're done voting. Uh-oh. <laughs> it's very heavily leaning towards die. We don't need her, someone says. <laughs> She's a mother, someone else says. Hmm. Oh! Someone else bought Green Chef. <laughs> I don't know. 60% says die. I'm still not gonna, I, I won't do anything until the poll runs out of time. I'm not gonna lie, I'm kind of leaning towards letting her die, as you can probably tell. It'll be good for character development. She had a happy life. She got married. She has two amazing kids. She can make money. We don't need money. I have 20,000 simoleons. Look how much money Blaze makes at work now. 383 simoleons an hour. Come on. Come on. Do I need her? The only reason I might need her is because I've got three dogs right now. But the kids will have trauma? That's okay. It happens. You know, people die. It's the circle of life. What? 59% <laughs> says let her die. The poll's almost done. I, I think, chat, there's no way it can come back from this. I'm really sorry, but... Hands off the keyboard. 
If she doesn't decide to get in the shower to save herself, that's her fault. Oh no. Oh yeah. That's rough. Will you plead for her? I don't know. Should I? I guess I could try. Got married for nothing? It wasn't for nothing, it was still true love. Oh no, 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 you don't wanna see this, not the puppy. Oh no, she burnt my, oh. she deserved to die. She caught the toilet on fire and it burnt my fish tank. At least the kids aren't here right now. That helps. Blaze, are you gonna, where's the Grim Reaper? Am I being silly? Where is the Grim Reaper? Oh, there he is. He went upstairs. Now, why did you do that? Demand Iris be spared. Should I try? I don't know. That's a little overconfident. You don't look like you're demanding. No! No! She came back to life! Ugh! I, this is stupid. This game sucks. Why do you even play this game? Quit crying, she's back, it's fine. Oh, oh. <laughs> thank you for buying green shot. <laughs> well, I'll take a little screenshot of this. This is for the scrapbook. The time that Iris got spared. She didn't deserve it. What's wrong with her? Nothing. Well, actually, you know what's wrong with her? She's alive. Do you get a milestone for saving her? Oh my God, does she get a milestone for coming back to life? Saved from death. Whoa, that's actually really cool. I haven't seen that yet. I haven't had a person die and then come back um, since we had milestones come out. That's pretty cool. Did Blaze get one for saving somebody? Oh. Really? I feel like saving somebody's life should get me, should get me a milestone. Well, <laughs> y'all are bullies and murderers, but most of all, heartless monsters if you want to kill her again. Okay, Ace, um, listen, maybe you're right. Maybe we are bullies <laughs> and heartless monsters. <laughs> but, um, you know? Are you satisfied with this outcome? Let's see what people say. There's another poll. Oh my God. A resounding no, we prefer death is the poll answer. I don't know if she'll die in the pond because she's in a good mood. Maybe I'll bake her a cake and let her have her birthday first at the very least. Maybe she'll, maybe she'll catch on fire trying to bake a cake. You never know. Anything's possible. Woo! <laughs> Thank you for buying Green Chef. Um, is now a good time to really quickly plug today's sponsor? Um, is my sim almost burning to death a good time to mention that if you use my link, you can get 60% off your order <laughs> from Green Chef? <laughs> Do you think they would approve? They know what they signed up for, right? Surely. 
This is brand safe. It's fine. She has a green top! <gasps> green chef! <laughs> You're so right. Do you know what? Her life would be so much easier if she used Green Chef. She wouldn't have to worry about thinking about what to cook. The whole cooking process would be less stressful. She'd be less stressed and therefore less likely to start fires because she's less stressed. I mean, if only she had it. Too bad. Yeah, it would save her so much time. She could like, you know, focus less on having a meal plan and everything and focus more on, you know, fires. Oh, she seems mad. Well, happy birthday. More than 60% of viewers wanted to kill her and there is 60% off with your code. Coincidence? <laughs> yeah, 60, 64% of chat just now said they are not satisfied with this outcome. Can she get hysterical? Ooh, good idea. Should we try and get her hysterical so she dies? You actually might be onto something with that. Okay, she's now an adult. Um, we are very playful from feeling playful. Maybe I can buy like a playful... It's a more wholesome way to go. You know, we can try and get a playful light too, to add to the vibes. Um. Oh, the orange one is playful decor. Well, there. Enable emotional aura. Um. Goof around. She is a goofball, so if anybody's gonna die from this, I feel like, you know. Dag, dag. Come on. Hysterical is a hard way to die. It's it's not an easy method. Maybe I could take a bubble bath. You've got a couple hours. Well, can you not get in there because of the dog? Okay, fair enough. We'll see if it works. No, I'm not very playful. Your Sim died from being hysterical on his wedding day? Oh no. This is not going well. Would you like to come here? Guys. Things are not working out for us. Oh, grade school A student. Good job. What do you wanna do with your time? Play chess maybe? Do I even have a chess table? Here, just go like, you can play pretend with your sister. I'm trying to worry about this. Pond? Mm, I don't know. Um. No, I should try and do it for real. We shouldn't cheat, we should try and do it for real. <gasps> what if we tried to get her smushed with the telescope? Are you going to use the bathroom? Are you serious? I just got out there. You can do that? Oh yeah. Why do we hate her? Oh, I don't! I like her! I think she's great. I really do like her. It's just that... She caught my house on fire. And she's... Oh no. I'm burnt out. Um... Okay. Well... Would you like to practice yoga again? Oh. 
I guess we didn't get our mischief skill up or our handiness skill up yet. I want to keep working on this until this goes away. Okay, 6 p.m. Is it gone yet? 11 minutes? Come on. Work in three days. I thought I had work today. Oh no, I do. Okay. I was gonna say, I want to go to bed. Or I mean, to work. Do we adopt more dogs? Oh no, we had we had puppies. What you might refer to as pulpies, because pulp had puppies. Anyway, they're gonna age up in two days. <laughs> Do you wanna fill this dog's bowl? Can you let the dogs go potty outside? Actually, maybe I'll have you do it. Ask to go potty, ask to go potty. See if that helps. Where's the other one? Ask to go potty. No, Blaze finished witnessing all the deaths. He finished his aspiration and stuff. Um, um, one second. Okay. Are they going outside? Oh, it's Blaze's birthday. Uh oh. Oh, ew. There's a mess up here. Throw that away. Okay. You mop that. Um, how are you doing? I guess you need to work on your piano skill. You want to practice? And then you need to probably take a shower. Performance gain small, okay. Take a bath? I don't know. What do you need? I thought I tried to get you to go outside. Did you not do it like I asked you to? Asked to go potty. The children are twins, yeah, Alice. That's one of the rules of this generation of Not So Berry is um, you have to have twins. So we have two kids that are both twins. Wait, do you want to help this one go outside too? Because I don't think they listened when I tried. Maybe they did. Yeah, we think Barbie's going to be the heir to the next gen because she has so many good traits. I finished like four aspirations with her. Look, we have all these traits that are aspiration bonuses. It's a lot. Okay, you are exhausted. You could probably go back to bed. Your sister probably doesn't need to go to sleep yet because she's mopping puddles. Um, you need to sleep. Annoyingly. And you can keep playing this. Okay, I think we've got everything under control. It does make a lot of sense for Barbie, it really does. Hey, someone else used our green chef coat, thank you so much. I really appreciate that. Um. Okay. Oh, you're mopping up the dog poop. Good! You're kind of just like spreading it around on the on the deck there though, which is maybe not ideal. <laughs> maybe not the best thing to do. <laughs> Probably shouldn't do that actually. <laughs> what is this code? Oh, um, today's stream is sponsored by Green Chef. They're giving you guys a huge discount code on their services. It's basically like a meal kit delivery service. Um, so you can pick out your meals for the week and then they'll send you the ingredients and the recipes. It makes it super easy to make like quick and healthy meals and stuff. Um, they also have a ton of options that fit pretty much anybody's needs. I like them because they have a lot of vegan and vegetarian options. Vegan and vegetarian options, sorry, I'm speaking too fast. <laughs> um, but anyway, they're giving you a huge discount code. You can get 60% off if you use our, our code. The code is kind of a weird one though. It's Pog Lil Simsy APR, like April 60. Um, but I, it might be easier just to use the link because it'll automatically apply if you click the link. <laughs> um, it's a, the code's a little bit long to type, so... <laughs> um, I've had great luck with it, though. Um, I'm actually going to cook one of the meals for dinner tonight. My box came today. I'm making some cauliflower tonight. It'll last for the, the whole month, Chocolate Turtle. So if you wanted to buy it, like, next week instead of this week or anything like that, um, it'll last for the whole month, so... Um, Okay, are you going to maybe go to bed now? I think things have calmed down a little bit, so you probably could. 
<laughs> Very nice. What meals have you gotten? Oh, today, this week, Emmy. Um, they're all vegan, the ones that I bought, but um, I got the cauliflower that I'm making today, the roasted cauliflower. There's a, I think, a stuffed pepper and also a noodle bowl um, that we got today. So I'm like, I just opened this box literally like two hours ago <laughs> and I already like, which ones did I pick out? <laughs> which ones did I get? Uh, the ones from the box that I opened two hours ago. <laughs> Okay, you go to bed. How are you doing at work? We need to get these skills up tomorrow. We have two days before our next work day. And we're level 9, so we'll get to level 10 soon. Very nice. Bed. Please. Please. Let me delete all this, clear it off. What is Dan eating? The same things. <laughs> um, it's like two servings, so. Just the same things. Okay. Um, would you like to put, oh, I guess auto lights are on. There's just a dog in there. I didn't see the dog. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry. Very nice. Oh. The way Pulp sleeps with their eyes open is so terrifying. Like, so beyond terrifying. Why are you doing that? Yeah, Blaze has to finish the career and then max uh, the baking and the charisma skills. So we're almost there. We're working on it. We're working on it. He's not even an adult yet. He's only a young adult still. So we got a lot of time. All right, how are we doing? Everyone needs to keep sleeping. Oh my goodness. The nighttime is horrible in this house because I'm so haunted. It takes a while to get through. Oh, really, Summer Girl? I'm so glad. That's a relief. I'm glad that it worked out so well for you. Um, what are you making? What'd you get? I'm so curious to hear. You're late and there's so many dogs. Yeah, I had, uh, my sim had puppies. They're gonna age up today. So, we'll see which one we want to keep. Whichever one is scarier, I'm going to keep. I'm not kidding about that. I can't have three dogs, but I can keep one of them. Can we get a close-up of them? Yeah, I can show you. They don't look that scary right now. I have hopes that they'll get scarier when they're older. Oh. This one is one that I have the highest hopes for. This one is named Tangy, and this one is named Zest. But all the puppies look the same, so there's potential that they could be scary. It's just hard to say. Um, ignore this. What dog is that? Never seen that. Don't worry about it. Never seen that dog before. Um, <laughs> duh, what dog? Prue? Never heard of that one. <laughs> what dog? I've never seen a dog named Prue. What are you guys talking about? I'm not really familiar. Are you gonna pee in the bush on purpose? Well, I guess that's one way to not start a fire, huh? <laughs> okay. Hey, somebody used our green chef code. Thank you so much. Uh, I really appreciate that. Uh, and Ken and Kimmy and Bird, thank you for the subs too. Okay. <laughs> anyway, nothing's going on here. I'm just gonna get some leftovers. All is well, everything's fine. Are you fully rested? Do you wanna use the bathroom? Were you trying to grill something? Oh my God, you didn't even finish it. What are you doing? 
You can kill pets. No, you can't kill pets. What you can do um, is age up your pet into an elder in Cass and then forget that, well, remember that when you age Sims up in Cass, it keeps the number of days that they are. So like if I aged up Iris right now, I would be like that many days into elderhood or whatever. Um, the problem is when you age your adult dog, who's been an adult for 14 days, up into an elder in Cass, then they're gonna have been an elder for 14 days. Well, guess what? Your dog isn't an elder for 14 days. So what happens? You come out of Cass and they immediately die. I'm just speaking from a story that I heard. I, this has never happened to me, obviously. I would never do that. But I heard that that is how maybe that would happen to you, if it were to have happened. Definitely did not happen to me, but hypothetically speaking, if it were to have happened to me, that's how it would have happened. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Thank you for buying Green Chef too. Anyway, um, I never, I don't know anything about that, but if I did, that's how it would have happened. So. Anyway, so happy you didn't have to go through that, Bessie. Yeah, me too. It must have been so horrible for the person that that happened to. <laughs> Winterfest starts tomorrow. Oh, fun. Can you bake my cake, please? No, it wasn't on purpose, Froggy. I mean, hypothetically, if it if it did happen, it wouldn't have been on purpose. It was not on purpose. Absolutely not. No way. Stop talking to the dog. Bake me a cake. Cook. It's just today's stream sponsored. Ah, oh, we've done two sponsored streams with the Green Chef today, Lydia. Well, not today. Wait, <laughs> we've done two sponsored streams with the Green Chef total. Um, there was one last week and one today as well. Uh, but the code will be available all month. I don't know why you're asking. Um, just in case you're curious about that. Um, we have two sponsored streams with the Green Chef though. So, <laughs> if one more person buys it, we'll have sixty nine on the bar. And then nobody else is allowed to buy it. That's how it works. I'm pretty sure, at least. <laughs> Just a guess. The oven fan is burnt. Oh yeah, I know, Allie. I leave it there on purpose. I kind of like it. So. What do you want? Yeah, you can be friends with that person. That's fine. That's fine. Can you finish baking your cake so you can age up? How did that get on fire? Cause this, uh, the stove caught on fire, so it spread. It makes sense when you think about it, but. Um, would you like to blow out the candles? No, the oven heads don't have a purpose in The Sims 4. They're just cute. That's all. Happy birthday! Oh, Veruta Shuska! <laughs> Happy birthday! Whoa. Blaze is officially an adult. Okay, can I bathe the dogs? Maybe I'll bathe the small ones. Uh -huh. Maybe you could bathe the other small one. How about that? That could work. Yeah, the house is on the gallery. I put it up on the gallery uh, when I first built it. So if you're looking for it, it'll be like from a couple of weeks ago. When are the twins aging up? Um, the twins age up, I think tomorrow. Yeah, one day. Tomorrow the twins will age up. We could age them up today though, because I'm bored of them being kids. So we could do it now. Now you can move out of the apartment. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Okay, Iris, now is a good time for you, honestly. Oops. Now is a good time for you, honestly, to get back to this. <laughs> if we were still stuck in the apartment, we wouldn't have pulpies. There would be no puppies for us. Where did the cake just go? I think somebody put it away. There we go. I can, I think I can age the kids up. Let's do it now. Ha <laughs> ha. 
Happy birthday! Come on. Happy birthday! Whoa, Kayla, I don't know where you got that number from. <laughs> I do not get $100 for each sale on Green Chef. <laughs> That's a high number. <laughs> no, I don't get $100 for each sale on Green Chef. <laughs> oh my goodness. Um, that is a lot. <laughs> no. <laughs> Let's not go spreading that one around. <laughs> okay, Barbie aged up. Barbie is gonna be the heir. Um, okay, NSV. I wanna make sure we get the right traits. So this pink generation of not so berry has to be neat, unflirty, and creative. I think I might get unflirty as a teen. Um, and then the aspiration that we have to have is the uh, best-selling author one. So we'll pick that too. <laughs> Yay! And then... You look mad. Why are you mad? Add birthday candles. We'll eat up your sister too. Blow out candles. Love the boots. Honestly, they're kind of good. Would you be allowed to do the teen aspirations and not so berry? Yeah, definitely if you wanted to. You can do whatever aspirations you want. I mean, the only thing is that at some point in your life, you have to finish the um, the main one, so. She looks just like your mom you just tried to kill. I have no idea what you're talking about. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna randomize Peppa's trait. Peppa's the other sim. Three, two, one. Bro and proper. I don't know if I like bro, that's boring. Too many social things. Geek, that's better. I like that better. Maybe we could be into like games. I like it. All right, let me save the game and then we can go into cast. She can play the Peppa Pig game. She can be a gamer. I like it. All right, let's go cast off full edit mode. Okay, we will give these Sims some makeovers then. <laughs> oh, Adrian, thank you so much for saying that. I really appreciate that. Do I have nine sims? I don't think I have nine sims, do I? Raisin, Blaze, Iris, yeah, Twins, bye. Dog, 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 eight. I have eight sims. All is well, everything's fine. Oh, it reset my face freckles. I have different ones now. I had, I think I had these before, right? I think she's pretty. We'll pick some different eyebrows. We can have all pink hair now, like we always dreamed of. The question is, what hair do we want to use? I don't know what eyebrows we'll use yet. You had nine before you moved out, Charlie? Yeah, I moved Charlie out ages ago though, before the puppies were born, in anticipation of this. Um, wasn't that, no, we only, had, we only had two puppies. We had two puppies and then pulp, three dogs. Someone just bought Green Chef. It's gonna be 69 now. Nice. <laughs> nice. Ponytail just like Barbie? That's true. That's a fun idea. I don't really like the texture on this one. I want one of the ones that's like shinier. Oh, Barbie might have this hair. I could totally see that. Right? Hmm. This one is pretty good. I don't like the swatch on that. Um. This is also kind of cute though. What's the lighter pink like? Oh, this one's more purple than pink, unfortunately. Um, this is kind of Barbie though. It's kind of good. Mm -hmm. I think I like it. Okay, let's try this. So as far as outfits go, 
We gotta wear all pink. Maybe, should I pick our sister's hair first before we get too far into this? Hold on. Oh, that necklace is so cute. Uh, is that one of the eco lifestyle mm. reward necklaces? That's a nice one. Okay, pink. Um, I mean, <laughs> I don't think I'm gonna use this. I think Peppa Pig. Pigtails? I think that would be good. I think that's kind of a win. <laughs> right? We should do pigtails. Also, somebody else just bought green chef. Thank you so much. I really appreciate that. Um, there's like braids that are pigtails. That could be kind of cute. I don't know. There's a lot of options. Um, can we keep glasses? I'm, yeah, maybe. I'm not doing this sim yet, so we'll have to come back to that. I do kind of like these braids. I haven't used these in a while. Maybe we'll use them. Um, and then just give you some little eyebrows. Any little eyebrows will do. All right, let's dress up Barbie. If you were Barbie, this is the air. So we need to think very seriously about this. Mm. I kind of want to wear like pink pants. We need to be like, it has to be the right shade of pink to match our hair though, I think. Although it won't, I need to drop that a whole concept. It's just not gonna happen. We do have some really cute options. Pink sparkly, ooh. <laughs> Maybe some of the kids stuff could be kind of cute. Mm -hmm. Those are not pink, liar. Um, I don't know, some of the like, the more recent like fashion kits that we've gotten might be really good for this. I'm on, um, how about, I thought I was on party wear for a second, I wasn't. What do we have from kits? I mean, well that's not really pink enough. This is better. Probably not for every day, but we can wear a fun skirt. Um, packs. Um, oh, sparkles. Oh, we can definitely wear this for one of our other outfits. We have to think like, kind of seriously. Oh, business Barbie. We have to think kind of seriously about like, what the vibes are that we're going for. I don't know. Um, let me go back to kits again. This again take me a while, I think. So, wish us luck. That'll be fun when we're older. <gasps> wow, pink. Mm -hmm. I don't know if I like most of these. This is kind of giving Gertrude. A sundress and heels. I don't know, we need to keep in mind that she is only a teen, so we can always like change it up when she's a little bit older and then pick something that, <laughs> who is Gertrude? Oh, Gertrude's my zebra print sim from The Sims 3. Everything is zebra print, everything. 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 Um, Barbie, what would you wear? Oh, this is kind of cute. It's too pastel though. I need like more vibrant. Oh, wow. Oh, I'm so not sure what I want to wear. You liked the pink jeans with the golden belt? Were those the, the jungle adventure ones? Because those could work. This is the problem. When you have pink, I feel like our options are so endless. So hot pink is the vibe. Well, it won't be all hot pink, but it'll be a lot of hot pink probably. 
to be honest. I think I want a skirt. I don't know which one, but I think I want a skirt. I do like this skirt. Maybe this skirt with like a shirt tucked into it could be kind of cute. This kind of says Barbie to me. Um, no. It needs to be tucked in. If it's not tucked in, then it's not gonna work. I've never seen this. Why is that class is pink? <laughs> that is just not pink. Liar. Um, I want some like, I think I want like a sweater. I don't know. I feel like it's very, there's a lot of pressure that's going into huh. dressing a sim that is so high fashion, right? Like it's not a simple task to pick outfits for literally Barbie. Hey Simsy, what day is it tomorrow? Um, Taylor Swift day. <laughs> tomorrow is in fact Taylor Swift day. Have I checked the full body section? No, we haven't really looked at the full body section for everything yet. Just for some of the pack items. I want more hot pink than this. I do like this top. I use this a lot though. Hold on, what if we, oh. That's kind of fun. This is so peach. That'll be good for the peach gen, I guess. You have to write oh. that down. The pink with yellow was so good. Mm. The problem is we don't really want to do pink and yellow. I would do this with the stripes over the pink and yellow. But I feel like, I don't know if I like this or not. This is kind of cute. We don't really want to wear anything that's not pink though. Mm. The yellow is too much not pink. Um, maybe we could do some, yeah. I guess a dress would be kind of cute as well. I do like the stripes, I think, on that. Oh, this is kind of cute. We could wear this. Or this one. You know, I use that one more often though, so maybe we could wear this. Shoes? I'm gonna do it. I'm just trying to think about what outfits I want to wear first, then we can go back. I have to do our makeup and stuff too. Um, okay. I want to pick some cute little earrings too. The hair is you brought with the clothes. So, uh, welcome to the Not So Berry Challenge. <laughs> yes. Welcome. <laughs> it's, it's gonna be a lot. This is just sort of how it goes. I kind of like those. Strawberry earrings. Oh, the strawberries could be kind of cute. Oh, these are from, um, these are the Eco Lifestyle Unlockables. Hmm. We could do ice cream for our hot weather outfit. Um, yeah, I think that I might go for the strawberry earrings. They're not, they're not saying they're pink though. So I don't love that. Maybe I liked these better. Is that better? I think I like the flowers. But they're literally a berry? I mean, that's true. They are literally a berry. I love the, I get some little eyeliner. We'll do some pretty pink eyeshadow. We can do a pretty pink blush. Probably definitely pink. Pretty pink blush. And then some pretty pink lipstick. That's not pink. I have all these like custom colors. Oh, that kind of works with her hair. Hmm. Can I wear a necklace with this top? Or does it hide? Oh, I can. Okay, do I want to wear a necklace with this top? Maybe we could wear this one on a different outfit. <laughs> I like this. Um, 
Let's see, fingernail polish. Let's do some like pretty pink. Oh, I don't know. Maybe I could find a better mm -hmm. colors pink. This is gonna take me so long, huh? Um, that one is a little bit more pink. This one is sparkly. Oh, I like these. I think I like that one. The sparkly was a little bit bold for me. Okay, we are in fact a teen. So, I don't think we're gonna wear like high heels to high school, but we can do that when we get older, you know? But we can pick for now just like some sneakers, I think, might be kind of cute with this. We do have a pink swatch of these, but maybe we could just do some white ones. The shirt is a bit too 40-year-old soccer mom. Okay. So we don't like the shirt anymore? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. You love the shirt. Okay, I'm- now I feel conflicted. I don't know. You're scaring me. Ooh. Why are none of these cropped enough? Why does nothing tuck in? That's like such an annoying aspect of this. It's like, why do we not have that many things that tuck into the... It doesn't match at all. Hmm. That doesn't match at all. This is not even pink. I think that's cute, but I don't know if I like it with this. Um, we're gonna try every single pink shirt. I do like the, um, the pattern on this shirt. I just wish that it was like, not so cropped. I want it to be a little bit less cropped. I always think that about this shirt. Sweater's boring. This is not pink, liar. Oh. Wait. I like the heart. I think that's kind of cute. With heart earrings. Do we have heart earrings? I don't know if we have heart earrings. We have a heart necklace. I do like the... From Seasons. Why can I not picture what you're talking about? Oh, we do have heart earrings. I mean, it's a lot, but it's kind of fun. You passed it twice? Okay. <laughs> okay. I kind of like that. In her lover era, oh my gosh. I think that's kind of cute. I like this. Maybe I shall um, just steal this so I have the same stuff. Not loving the lipstick though. Is it really that bad? Everybody has such negative opinions about the lipstick. The Sims name is Barbie. Oh my god, that's bright. <laughs> that is really bright. Um, okay, let's pick the dress back again. Um... Let's see. I'm only gonna make it worse when she grows up. Oh, somebody else bought Green Chef. Thank you so much. Um, where's my little dress that I wanted? It was from high school years. Let's go back. You think it's the ponytail? Well, the ponytail is gonna stay too. I think that you guys, I feel like um, 
I don't mean this in a bad way, but sometimes I think that chat hates fun. Because you're like always trying to tone down the not so berry challenge sims. When like, this is the not so berry challenge. Like if we're gonna do something like this, um, and do like, you know, silly, bright pink everything, like, like this is the exact time for us to do it, you know? Uh, this is, in fact, like, the perfect opportunity to do something like this. So, I think it's kind of fun. <laughs> Alright, let's pick a prom dress. If you were Barbie, what are you wearing to prom? It's gotta be beautiful. I want it to be sparkly, even. It's so important. I mean, honestly, no, I don't like the, I don't like this dress very much. It's very hard for me to use these base game dresses these days. Um, I feel like Barbie would have such a classic prom dress. I just don't really know, like, does this come in pink? That is not sparkly though. I do like the lace on this one. Is there something shorter? Oh, maybe. Um, oh, that's not sparkles, Never mind. This is sparkly, but I don't like the cut of this either. Oh, you like the lace dress? I do like the sparkles on this. With her hair down for formal. That's what I was kind of thinking. We would change her hairstyle. We could get something pretty. Maybe not that one. I love the idea of like a pretty... I don't know. Would she have like an updo, maybe? Why does it have to have blue in it? I don't want blue. I'm Barbie. Only pink. No. No, I don't know. Um, Barbie likes blue? Yeah, but the Not So Berry Challenge doesn't like blue. This is the Not So Berry Challenge. It has to be all pink all the time. Hmm. I think that I'm being too picky. I think I need to calm down a little bit. Like, this is kind of silly how I'm like refusing to decide. But no, I don't like the texture, like with the pink, you know how the swatches are different on different hairstyles and like some of them are shinier than others. I don't like the pink on that one. Can she wear a crown or something? Oh my goodness. I don't know if there is one. Oh, do you know what? I would have actually, I think I have the crown unlocked because I've won prom, oh my God, I've won prom queen before. So we could wear the crown. <laughs> we could wear the crown in advance of it. Yeah, I think so. Um, oh, I don't like that. Why am I being so picky about, like, what hairstyle she wears? Manifesting prom royalty. No, we have to win prom queen now. I'm already wearing the crown. <laughs> Manifest winning this way just by wearing it. Showing up with the crown already on. Um, I can't decide. Why do none of these have bangs? either. I guess I kind of liked this one. We could wear this. What do you think about that? Pretty ponytail? It's pretty. I think I like it. That one looks like Elsa. Okay, that's a win, actually. I 
wish there was a brighter pink on this. Barbie's prom dress is bright pink. Why are none of these things hot pink? Maybe she can wear this one. This is fine. This is pretty too. We'll get some really nice nail polish as well. Um, we shall put on some pretty pink eyeshadow. Pretty pink blush. And then... Nobody likes my pink yeah. lipstick. So we have to be careful which one we pick, chat. Because they don't like it. I like this one. I think this is nice. I think we need a brighter nail polish, though. Uh, colors... Pink. Oh, I'm already on it. Sorry. <laughs> I don't know why I, like, didn't realize. Um, this one is pretty fun because it's sparkly. It might be a little bit too bright, though. Oh, I like how this one has, like, the pink and the white. Okay. And we can just wear some heels. I don't like her lipstick anymore. Oh, no. This is ridiculous. Um... More pale? I don't know. Jewelry? I don't know if I want her to wear any jewelry for this. I think I might be thinking about it too much. No. I don't know. I don't like a lot of the- Oh, this has some gold so it matches our crown. That's good. That's good. Mm -hmm. Okay. Athletic. Little earrings, maybe? Oh, can you see her ears? Oh, her ears are hidden, so we can, we don't need to do earrings. Okay, let's use some of the, um, the stuff from this pack. Ooh, that matches really well. <laughs> I like it. That is really good, okay. Very nice. Um, Maybe a corsage? I guess I didn't think about that. We could do that. It's under... Go away. Oh, is it because I'm filtered by pink? Am I being silly? We do have a bracelet one, right? Yeah. Oh, why does that have to be gold? Or, I mean, silver. That's not what I want. These all look terrible. Never mind. Don't want it. There's a tennis dress? That's true. Barbie would probably have at least one version like that. We can wear that too. It's the same colors, but we have like... Huh. What if she doesn't win prom queen? Is she just gonna be wearing a crown? Well, she deserves prom queen, so if they don't give it to her, then... She's gonna walk around in her crown. I insist upon winning. If they don't give it to me, that's their fault. They should have known I would wear it, so. I like it. Okay, I don't really like any of these shorts. I guess the sweatpants might be kind of good. Is anything more like... Oh, these are kind of cute. I know they have a belt, but ignore that. Because we would wear, like, a, um, a bigger t-shirt on top of it. That would hopefully hide the, the belt so you wouldn't know. Because I don't want that. Oh, I don't like this. Never mind. Um... Hey guys, I'm gonna say this just one time, okay? We really do not vibe with the body shaming of Sims here, okay? So let's stop. <laughs> it's not fun, it's not cute, it's like not the vibes. Um, so stop. <laughs> 
I, I like even I don't really understand what you mean if you're trying to say it as a joke, but even if you somehow are not bad intentioned, we're talking about like bodies and and like this is not some it's like this represents life, right? It's not cool to do that. It can hurt people's feelings in real life. It's it's not just a sim like it's it's beyond that. So let's be a little bit careful about how we talk. Okay. Um, let's see. Barbie's going to a party, so I think I want to wear the sparkly shirt from the kit. Mm -hmm. I think that's the one for me. Packs, kits. Yes. <laughs> Absolutely. Um, and then what, like a little skirt, maybe? I don't know. It has to match the colors of the... <laughs> This is not the same shade of pink. Oh, that is hot pink. Oh my gosh. Wait. I don't know if we have anything this hot pink. I don't think it's there. I don't I don't think it exists. Oh, that sucks. What do we do? Is there a matching skirt? I mean, from the kits, I, there is a skirt, but it's not like exactly matching. It's like, you know, maybe a black skirt. I don't know. I feel like we could do like pink pants. Maybe. Because I- I'm okay with that. Hmm. Is Barbie in her, like, cargo pants era? Barbie's always been trendy. I don't know if I like it. Or we could do, like, jeans. Uh, no. No. None of this is working for me. Not even remotely. Oh my god. I don't know. I kind of- I liked the color of these cargo pants, though. So... Um... Was that person telling me to grow up about the sim? About saying this about the body shaming of sims? Oh, good God. So you got banned for that, but we're going to talk about this together for a second chat. So <laughs> every time we go and cast, we have to we have to have this conversation because people can't keep their stupid mouths shut. So we're, we're playing a game, right? But this is a life simulation. So these sims are simulating life. So when you say nasty things about a sim and you're making specific comments about like, you know, parts of their face being weird or, you know, calling them ugly or pointing out things about their body. You're, it is a sim, right? But this simulates life. And there's real life people in the chat who probably look like that. So you just suck by saying those things. Maybe you don't mean any harm, but it is harmful. So we don't let you do it. It's not me being dramatic. I don't need to grow up. This is a very reasonable request. I'm just asking you guys to not be mean. It's really simple. I'm sorry that that's too hard for you. I don't know what to tell you. Like, <laughs> it's really easy to be nice. So, <sighs> anyway, <laughs> this is why I kind of like don't love doing creative sim stuff on stream because are we wearing heels? Do people wear heels with pants like this? I'm not very fashionable. Ooh, these nails kind of match. That's kind of fun. But it's literally so easy to be nice. It's so easy to be nice. Barbie wears heels. Barbie does wear heels though. The heeled boots from university. Don't they have a lot of like black mm. accents on them though? Um. Are these the ones that we're talking about? They- I don't know if I like the black. Chunky sneakers will be fun. Yeah, we wear sneakers for all of our other outfits with Barbie, except for her formal wear. Um, I mean, this is like a... 
an obvious choice, but I kind of want to like... I don't know. These do have a pink swatch. Maybe I'll just wear those. Clown shoes. Oh, you know what? Maybe you're onto something. <laughs> Maybe you're onto something. I'm sorry we had to have that talk again, chat. I know it's like not the vibes. It's no fun to have to talk about stuff like that, so. It's every time though. I don't know what is wrong with these people. I like the I like those earrings. What is Barbie if not obvi obviously over the top? Exactly. Exactly. Um okay. Lover era. <laughs> okay, swimsuit. What's the vibes? Um, maybe we could have like a cute pool cover up option and a cute swimsuit option. Barbie is neat and unflirty. Those are the traits that we have to have for um, for the not so berry challenge. So, do we want a full body swimsuit? Why are these like not pink enough? I do like this one, but I don't know. It's not. Why do I feel like these are not good shades? Oh, this is, okay, this is Barbie. Come on. Come on. I know it doesn't match her hair that well, but come on. This is Barbie. We probably would wear a sun hat, right? I think so. I know it's- well, I guess maybe we could do that for our, like, this outfit. Because this is more like the one that we wouldn't be actually wearing in the pool, you know? Is there a pink one? Oh my god, there's so many hats. I don't know. Oh, we can need some- we need to wear some sunglasses too. That's important. Too much purple toned? Yeah, strawberry shortcake, this is the thing. I don't know how much of the Not So Berry Challenge you've seen, but this is a very common occurrence. There's there's never going to be an exactly right, like, matching shade of pink, so... Um, we kind of just got to do what we got to do. <laughs> it won't be the same color. It just won't. Um, it's not possible, so... We use different ones. I'm obsessed with this, to be honest. I think that's so fun. Maybe I'll wear some different sunglasses for this outfit. Do these come in hmm. not pink? Well, never mind. I'm going back to the base game ones. Oh. That cover-up is gonna tan hilariously. Oh my god, you're right, it would. <laughs> I had this problem. I totally forgot about it. I had this problem in my not so berry challenge or my, my legs challenge on YouTube, sorry, where I have my sim tan in this swimsuit. And she had like a triangle, <laughs> the triangle tan line from the inside of this. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> um, okay, mm -hmm. let's go see some hot weather outfits. Oh my god, what is with the trolls today? This is too much. Too much. Sims can tan now? Yeah, if you've got Island Living, they can. Um, the tan was amazing. It was kind of good. It was kind of good. Um, all right. Um, hot weather. Should we wear like a little sundress? For hot weather? I don't know. Kind of iconic, the heart dress. Oh, I wanted to wear the ice cream earrings for this. So that's a definite yes. I don't know if I like any of these dresses. Maybe we could do um, the, well, let me pick my ice cream first. Hold on. Perfect. <laughs> There's a bunch of really cute like pink um, shorts and skirts and stuff that we could try to use. Aren't, isn't there like some pink scalloped shorts that we almost use? What about these? These might be kind of fun. I like those. I wonder if we can try and match any... 
the floral crop top doesn't really match that. These are really cute shorts though. Oh, this doesn't come in like plain. Hmm. The polka dots are kind of fun to be honest. <laughs> what do you think about that? Let's plan the whole outfit around the ice cream earrings. Yeah, that's kind of what I'm going for to be honest. Um, I think I'm liking this. I don't know, the growing together tank too? I think the growing together one is too long. I think that it, um, it won't, I think it'll go past the shorts. Let me show you what I mean. I tried it with the other one. Yeah, see? Oh, unless you mean this one. Oh, cause this one's kind of cute. Ooh. I don't like this shade of pink. Do we do white? Is that bad? That's not pink enough. Maybe if we got a pink necklace. I don't like that one. The white is cute. It's just not, it's not screaming, not so berry challenge. It's okay though. Let's get some some pink sandals. That could work. <laughs> um, pink nail polish? We can do some pink bracelets too, that'll be good. It'll, it'll bring it all together. And we'll have our pink necklaces, and, or our pink uh, makeup, I mean. So that'll help. That works. I just didn't like the swatch of the pink. Yeah, they have toenail polish too, I know. Um, I never really use it because most of my Sims wear closed toed shoes most of the time. Maybe we could do like a lip gloss. Oh, chat's not gonna like that one. Should I do it anyway? It's shiny. I kind of like it. <laughs> it's a sparkly gloss. This is so Barbie. You can't pretend that it's not so Barbie. Not so Barbie. Okay, I like this hot weather outfit. And then the last thing is the cold weather outfit. We might not have time to do Peppa's outfits today on stream, but that's okay. Um, I have a lot to do tonight because I need to get ready for my Taylor Swift concert. So <laughs> I won't be able to uh, finish all of this today, but we can finish the cast next time we stream. <laughs> Does Barbie wear hats? Maybe. Um, let's see. No, I don't like that one. Uh, I don't like that one. Oh, the beret. Wait, isn't that an unlockable? How, what's the um, cast unlocks cheat again? How, do you know what the one is for, specifically for city living? Cause I don't think I have it. It's just eco lifestyle. I think that there is one from city living. I know because um, one of the townies wears it. You think there's one in eco lifestyle? Oh, I guess there is one in eco lifestyle. I don't, well, that's not really what I was picturing. No, not the cast off let it mode or the um, r3m.unlock cast. I don't think that's it. It would be like EP3, how to unlock, what's the nifty knitting one? Cause then we can try it. Cast.unlock by tag SP17 is the nifty knitting one. Huh. So hmm. that's SP17, I didn't want that. I wanted. What is it EP3? What pack is City Living? Yeah. EP3. Hmm. EP03? No. No way unlocked tagged parts? I might have gotten it. No. No. Hmm. Hmm. 
I want the beret. Close out of the hats menu, reopen it. Oh yeah, I didn't do that, did I? No. Yeah, I don't know. Well, we don't have to wear it, it's fine. <laughs> it's fine, we can just go with cold weather stuff, it's okay. Like, maybe we can always add to it later as well. Um, I don't know. It is EPO3. Yeah, Miko's beret is one that I'm trying to find. Um, okay, let's think about pink cold weather outfits. And while we're trying to decide this chat, I want to give a, a last huge thank you to our sponsor today, um, Green Chef. <laughs> uh, I've actually had such good experiences with Green Chef. I know a lot of you guys have too. Um, if you're not familiar, Green Chef is like a meal deliver meal kit delivery service where you like pick out your meals for the week and they send you the ingredients, uh, like pre-portioned and everything and the recipes and stuff so that you can cook them. Um, it's super helpful. It takes out so much stress of planning. It's really, if you're busy, it's really easy to have something like that because then you always have stuff to make a nice home cooked, healthy meal. Um, so I have really appreciated using it in times where I've been really busy. Um, I keep saying this, but like, I'm so excited to have it in May when we're doing the St. Jude streams because I'm going to be streaming so much. <laughs> it's going to be so helpful to have food in the house that's like easy to cook and already decided for me, you know? Um, they also have a lot of vegan and vegetarian options and all their stuff is certified organic. So if you're interested, um, they have a lot of options for like any needs. If you they even have like keto options, if you need that, um, but they've got like stuff for everybody. So, um, it's not like only veggie stuff, but, um, I think you'll probably have uh, really good luck with them if you're interested. And we have a huge discount code. You can get like 60% off. Um, not like 60% off. You do get 60% off <laughs> if you use our code. So, um, and there's a link in the chat uh, for how to automatically take you there. I don't like any of these coats. These are not screaming Barbie. Maybe this one's screaming Barbie. No, I don't think so. Um, okay. Um, the first one did. I don't know. I didn't like the shade of pink. I need pinker and I need like more, um, is there a puffy jacket? There is, but I don't know if it comes in pink. The snowy escape jacket. Which one? This one? You like this one? I don't like it with the hat, but I do like this one. Mm -hmm. Teens usually wear crop jackets. Yeah, a lot of teens do. This one, um, this is pink. And will the St. Jude thing happen? We're gonna stream, uh, do charity streams for literally the entire month of May. The entire month of May. So, <laughs> this one is pink. Um, I guess we did ask for that. So, <laughs> that's good, I guess. Um, I don't really like these. I feel like I want to give her some, hmm. like, simpler pants and we can give her some boots to go with them. She has bangs, doesn't she? Yeah, but I, this, I was trying to give her a hat so it wouldn't be a problem. No, she doesn't have a hat on, so it is a problem. Why are these not hot pink enough? These ones are hot pink. Should we do white jeans if we're gonna wear something this dramatic? Do you know what? Actually, now that I think about it, this one is kind of good because it has, um, what pack is this from? Get Famous, right? The hair, that's right. Um, it has the orange accent and the previous gen is the orange gen. So maybe it's kind of cute that she's got like a little orange t-shirt to match her dad's generation. I don't know. We've done that before. We had a little bit of that when they were kids. So it might be kind of cute now. Let's go a little bit more purple tone with the lipstick. The Uggs are very Barbie. The Uggs aren't as hot pink though, are they? There's like a light pink. Where are they? 
It's an option. <laughs> oh, we could do the snowman earrings too. That'd be good. And then we could probably say we're done with her outfits for now. And we'll come back and um, do her sisters next time we stream. Oh, that's actually really cute. Do you know what? I love Barbie. I think she's turned out really adorable. I'm excited. And the next time we stream Not So Berry, we'll, um, we'll finish doing her sister's outfits um, and do the house and stuff, redo their bedrooms and everything. Um, I'm excited. I feel like this has gone really well. Hopefully you guys enjoyed playing today. Um, so stream schedule. Okay. I cannot stream on Friday, but I will be here tomorrow morning. We're going to do like a short stream. Um, a short stream of some Stardew Valley tomorrow morning before I leave because I'm going to see Taylor Swift tomorrow. So I, I can't stream at the regular time because this time tomorrow I'm going to be at a concert. So I can't be live tomorrow. Um, I'll be live again on Friday though. And we're going to play Sims 3 on Friday. Um, and I'm not sure what day we'll stream Not So Berry next, uh, next week. Maybe like on Monday, probably. I don't know. Um, next week, I'm looking at my stream schedule. Uh, Pietro's birthday is next Wednesday. So we've got big Animal Crossing plans next Wednesday as well. So <laughs> perfect, perfect. Anyway, uh, thank you guys for hanging out today. It's been a lot of fun. Uh, if you're curious to buy, curious to buy, if you're interested in buying Green Chef, uh, I'll have the link in my panels for a while and stuff. Um, so hopefully it's easier for you to find if you wanted to buy it like, you know, in a couple weeks or whenever works best for you. Um, don't feel like you have to, but if you wanted to, you can go for it. And thanks again to Green Chef for sponsoring us today. I'm gonna go see who is live so we can try and find somebody to raid. Um, I'll see you guys tomorrow morning so we can uh, be very excited about Taylor Swift together. <laughs> um, and I think, do you know what? My dear friend, uh, Griffey, <gasps> is building a tiny house for Kyle Kyleson. Oh my God. Okay, well, that's easy. No questions asked. I know exactly where we are going. <laughs> we gotta go watch this tiny house for Kyle. 100%, that is where we need to be. Okay, well, let's go hang out there and then I'll catch you all tomorrow morning um, and we'll we'll stream. I think I'll be live at like nine o'clock tomorrow morning. Maybe even eight, I don't know, probably nine though, cause I need to make sure I'm ready before. I'm gonna leave like as soon as I get off stream. So I need to make sure I'm ready before we go live, so. Anyway, have a, oh, somebody bought Green Chef. Thank you. <laughs> have a great rest of your night and I will see you all tomorrow. Yeah, okay. Goodbye, everybody. I don't know why I said it like that. That was so weird. Goodbye, I don't know. <laughs> Stop streaming.